Welcome back everybody, this is LizMarina300 speaking, I hope all of you all enjoyed the previous video, I know I enjoyed making it for all of you. In the previous video we did some ghost hunting, we did a mission on March 7th, although I would have loved um, having a more expansive lore mission for March. So, we can jump right into this one today, because we're going to do some more hunting, like uh, ghost hunting. Hmm. Let me greet all the. Uh, let me greet the viewers real quick. Real quick. There we are. Hello, and. Where are we? Yes, we're here. Oh yeah, we are Trailblaze level 55. I haven't been here, so I'm going to touch places for far between the level food. I want to look at Jade Gate. I can get on top of that. Oh, there's a lot when I, I did a lot when I was young. I finally got it yesterday, workload done, so I'm taking a break. I was going to send you a photo, but the signal is acting funny. Text messages are coming in slower than usual. Big sigh. Just when. Just when I thought nothing would go through, I'm leaving. This is an instant hour. <clears throat> Crane delivered official document and emergency meeting is coming up. I gotta go back down to the. Oh, wicked crane. After all. Alright. You want express, we ship whatever you want. <laughs> ship it. Okay, um. Hold up, everyone. Make sure to. Right. Alright. Submission marks. There we are. And as per usual, there's something wrong with the pinning thing. Um, Simon's. There we are. Right. Ah, oh, well. Travel log. This. Oh, okay. Yep. Oh yeah, I did want to go check that fire thing. It's like a thing out. Um. No. Ways. You got Pathfinder? Uh. With the chest goes. Okay, okay. Here he is. It's like we're immediately fighting. Oh. 
There we are. That was much easy. How much of this can I do? One, two, three, four, five. Would be good if people just use their eye to retag the rules. Yeah, I guess. Because if people read the rules and stuff, oh, let's get started. What is it? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Do I feel like I'm one, two, three, four? There we are. Reading first. Yeah. I just fully read the rest of the Star Wars trilogy. That's what yours. You made it. Come on. Let's do this. If we turn into an obstacle. If we turn into an obstacle, it's obstacle. Ah. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we are. Oh, that's easy. So you're gonna pull the characters in game right now, you're gonna make me that shot. It says I think about a five star. You bet I'm pulling. You bet I am pulling. Come on. Come on. Come on. Five star. Five star. Damn it. Just a collapsing sky. How many of these are there? Make okay, a full power, you say. Okay, so up, left. That was easy. Is that? Oh, what? Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. Would you look at that? Great. The Ooh. more the better. Let's go. 
I don't know how much there are, really. One, two, three, four, five. So I think I'm gonna keep my digging wood where I'm at home. <laughs> so the ghost is now begging me not to win. Two, three, four, five. No. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Okay. This is very easy. Case I will make you steal my own potential prepared face the ultimate channel final challenge. Yes. A chess match never has been seen before. Give me a bit of and let's start. It said this one's the final one. Two, three, four, Excuse me, was it just me or was this easy as hell? One, two, three, four, five. Mm -hmm. Two, three. Yes. Losing is losing. Let's not change that. Just guys have seen you on top. Ah, uh, don't try and butter me up. I secure myself when you crew. I will not be merciful next time. Great. What? Nah, man. Oh, why is that? I didn't think I did something that bad. Maria? I got an achievement as well if I remember correctly. Oh, achievement. Achieved. I've been treated just a hundred times in the journey. Inf obtain f total of Pathfinder rewards. Nice. Stargazing the bar. Uh, what am I looking for again? Yeah. Up there. Sweet. 
Not haste. There we are. Okay. Now I'm off. Did that see me? Seriously? Speak, not haste. An invisible? Whoa, if you disappeared, did you see it? The fan of the sky skiff disappeared. Could I ask who you are? I'm seeing, I'm seeing, I met her before. Uh, there's no dialogue. I don't like it. I don't like when there's no dialogue. It's just like a movie, just with subtitles and no sound. When it starts, oh, wait, Madam, you phone is possessed. Well, I swear, I was literally just talking to her when she was she was on the top of the gates. Another was on top of the, ahead of us. Okay, was it that gate? Was it up there? Which gate? Yeah. Technically, how how will be accurate? Same as this dream. I didn't click anything. Yeah. So much non dialogue, it is irritating me. Okay, we're about to reach 20,000 ghost hunting followers, I guess. Let's go. Since when did thick storm go? Speak, not haste. Here's the the star skip. Is that fair? You dare the star. Back. What? Excuse me. Break the wind. I fight a phantom. Let's make it quick. Huh. Component damage. What? That's like infinite damage. Oh, 
Her next turn will be the thing that absolutely annihilates her. If I don't right now. Let's go. Yeah. Absolutely. What? <laughs> Skipping dialogue? It doesn't have any audio. There's no action. Di There's no audio. There's no dialogue audio. That's what I look for. There is none. Rules are made to be broken. I can stop. I can like not not skip. That's what you'd prefer, as you could have like, surrendered. Whole story. Of... I don't want to do that. It doesn't really propose it. Some is interesting. Okay. And I won't from now on um, do that. Do you admit this? Can't hurt me. The wind is rising. From the boat. I'm I'm not skipping. Okay, then I won't skip from now on. Stay the course. It's time. Me. When is my healing character going to be coming into play? Excuse me, what? These are devils. I'll crush them all. Definitely have gone up for one. These are devils. I'll crush them all. Leaving till the end, okay? Oh, 
in the heck is this battle? Okay. One on one. I got an achievement for that. That was good then. Let's come back with four characters, but only win with one character standing. And I like heals more than. Um. Okay, good. More prefer not skipping. Okay, I won't skip, I will be saying it out then. <laughs> a person... A person's thoughts for someone could take the form of a scar skiff in return. I see no... I see... I see, sir. I see. So Hiliobai are even capable of such things. Times like this makes me recall how Madame Hanya, Hanya said Hiliobai a simple star fair essence attracted by emotions. Perhaps Hiliobai never acted based on concept such as good or evil. You have a point? Well, I know this spoils the moon. Just say it. I got the picture of I got a picture of the Phantom Skarsgård. How about making a post right now? That I can't on you. Yep. Not that one will be best. I'll click on that one though. I believe Madame Yun Hong will still return to this place in the future. <laughs> That's all for today. See you let see you all later. I am not good at voice acting, so don't even question me. It's bad. And yes, look at that. Target a hundred thousand fans. Begin investigation. Ghost hunting squad. First off. First off. <laughs> we shall do this. Yay. Because it is our daily mission. Uh, listen to Adler's ghost stories. Oh, isn't that just the thing in there? I'd love to know. Oh. Whoops. He didn't notice how bizarre the darkness of his surroundings had become, nor did he notice them looming. Wait, no. This is just a daily. This is just a daily. Dailies are not that important. Find the toilet in the store. Find the toilet. Toilets in this place? Probably gonna ask around, because I have no idea what they're talking about. Cause it's a daily, I don't really care. Daily, I don't really go. These are devils. I'll crush them all. Spirit never dies. You could have surrendered. Uh, 
Uh, what? what? Sorry, but as I said, dailies I don't really care about. I will be doing the no skipping for the other things and doing like voices, but hmm, I wonder if I should get into voice acting then to like tone my voice. That would be really cool. Let's Fifty-six, that's nice. Or I can continue doing that, or I can just do this game. I will be doing that. But before I do do that, um Troll Car Pom Pom. We're going to Pom Pom! Getting so close. My pom pom sad. Pom pom sad, so we shall go to pom do pom poms then. Ooh, we can get that. It's getting late. Where to now? And done. See that? Now, no, this one. Oh, uh, whoops. Hello, let's get started with today's operations. Dialogue The Ten Lords Commission Special Operations Team for the Heliobus Containment Breach Incident. AKA the ghost hunting squad is ready for action. Yeah. Yeah. Doesn't yeah. really send any happy. Welcome. Let's go to Looks like we're the only ones in good spirits today. I'm sleepy. Oh, little Gwei. What kind of magical elixir did you take to make you so energetic? Every time I see our follower count increase, I get so excited I can't even sleep. It works better than any kind of tea or coffee. I am that's relatable. When I saw it go to 13 followers, uh, when I saw it go to two followers, I got extremely excited. Now I'm at 13. Every single time I see people even online and viewing like you guys are, I still get excited and I can't go to sleep until about 4.30 in the morning. As soon as I closed my eyes, I dreamt of endless running and circling and chasing after Lady Bailu. <laughs> it was even more exhausting than doing it in real life. Seriously? Sushong, you slept for an entire day. Catching ghosts is a night job. It only makes sense to sleep during the day. Uh huh. Yeah, an idea. How about we all just pretend that I've been possessed by a sleep ghost? Let me sleep for another ten hours and then call it a day's work. Seriously? Sounds like you spent time with Pusin. That's, a... uh, that's the celestial jade player over at Exalting Sanctum. Whenever I pass through on official business, I always see her with loads of other players. Hmm? Oh, whoops. Even a judge knows her. Her reputation sure does precede her. Who is this exactly? Uh -huh. I'm just about to get a drink. It's this girl. Here, look at this post. Everyone is acting sus. Plus 45,000. Hi, take my job seriously. I never post something like late as usual on a public forum. Miss Sushong, uh, I think you missed the interesting part. 
The description in this comment is really suspicious. It definitely sounds like Heliobi activity to me. And if Heliobi have managed to infiltrate the Divination Commission, that spells big trouble for the Lafu. Mm -hmm. You're right. Maybe we should contact Miss Chingchue and warn her not to go to work today. Since when is she? That's a good idea. We should send out a message, or people's curiosity will get the better of them. Uh -huh. Don't worry, I haven't. I just saw the person. As I took the left to turn out the door, so what happens? So, what exactly has happened? Why is everyone looking so sluggish? The guard gate doesn't let anyone in or out of the divination. Stay safe, we'll be right there. Gotcha. Now I'm a real door guardian. <laughs> Notification sent. I guess now we should go to the Divination Commission and see what's going on. I can put this all on the ghost hunting. Let's talk to really. Cirrus again first. I can? Okay. People might want to see the individual, so... P-E-R-C-I-P-I-E and the C. Oh. Read all dialogue. I will. That's what I said I would do when I did on you. Oh yeah, there's flammable rewards. Oh well. I'll read that later. So. You imprison Luxie in the Matrix. And I heard the cries of other Heliobi longing to break free. Hmm. That would seem the Ten Lords Commission has everything under control. What is it you want from me? Same old, same old. One victory equals one question. Uh, uh, don't forget the agreement you made with the General. Don't be so sure of victory before the battle begins, young one. Without tail to protect you, isn't so doing a heliobus a bit overwhelming for you? You know, if you can accept me with an open heart, I can take his place and help you. Uh, real, of course. That's what I wanted to hear. Oh, the fact that you're trying so hard to persuade me means that you're not sure of victory either. If you <laughs> were, you'd have devoured us without hesitation. Am I right, Cirrus? Then have it your way. I'll destroy Ching Yuan's pawns here and now! Nah, man. Don't All this trial. This victory go to your heads. The slightest mm. misstep will be your undoing! Oh, I know. I know indeed. The general here to watch your back. I will never rest. Your mortal bodies will fatigue and breathe their last. Um, that was easy. Why is everything getting so easy? We did it! Ask your question. We think the Divination Commission has been infiltrated by Heliobus, but we don't know which one. Entering the Sienjo's window to the future... It must be none other than... Kiraloom. They always relished hounding your prophets and seers with questions of your destiny. Watching them flounder between the random and the preordained. <laughs> that pile of protein in your human skull is computationally inefficient. Your conjectures on destiny are little more than analogies and illusions. But we, the shapeless, are different. When we come together to harmonize and observe, destiny is clear and vivid as firelight cast into darkness. 
Ugh, in warfare, nothing is more important than being able to predict your opponent's movements. Among the fragments of Ignamar, Karalum was in charge of knowing the past and predicting the future. It is said that during that fateful battle, Karalum had a premonition of failure, but Ignamar ignored their warnings. It looks like we have a clear target this time. Let's get going. You shall. I may not have the same predictive power as Karalum, little fox girl. One thing I do know is that sooner or later you will beg for my help. Nah, we're just gonna beat your ass again. <laughs> time will tell. But well, indeed. Damn. Let's go. Hmm. Fuck you. Sorry, I'm not so upbeat as I was for my like three hour ones and died. stuff. My two hour, three hour you ones and all of that. It's just that um, uh, usually have a monster before stream or and during stream, and uh, I haven't been having that. Story in your own way. I haven't been having that because we don't have any. So I'm very low on energy. Oh, look at Trotter. By the order of the Ten Lords, execute the Marastruck! The wind is right. Boats. From the boat! Rules are made to be broken. This is meant to be the order of it. This Marastruck is here. Everyone's on one life. <laughs> The All at once. Congratulations. What? Uh, yeah, I usually have a monster. You know, the drink monster. The full of stream. Or also, I have. I sometimes have tea, or I have um, or a coffee. But I have no tea. I don't have a monster. And for the coffee part, um, I gave it to my mom because she needs it more than me. She's something stressful has popped up with her. Oh, you're here. So, yeah. Is that a Ten Lords Commission judge? It is indeed. Something's amiss in the Divination Commission. Everyone is mumbling to themselves. Is this some workforce overhaul? Did I set a bad example? Ha <laughs> uh, I'm afraid not, Miss Tingtre. Something unexpected happened. I'm just not sure how to explain it. Uh, the, the Divination Commission may have been infiltrated by some unknown creature. If you rush in, you could become a target too. Miss Sushan, we're supposed to be operating in secret. I want Ching Chua to have an idea of the gravity of the situation. Hmm. I suppose Miss Ching Chua should be safe enough. One we're chasing probably has a more uh, complicated target. That sounds like a compliment, but at the same time. I'll just take it as a compliment. Yeah. In that case, Miss Jingtre, could you stand guard here for us while we investigate? Hey, it um... It doesn't seem like a good idea to just stand here under uh, such dangerous circumstances, does it? Does anyone here like Star Wars by any chance? Does anyone here like Star Wars? I mean, you could leave, but... Wait, are you thinking of coming with us? Didn't you see how bad the situation was? Yeah, yeah, I've seen it all right. But if I leave now, won't that count yes. as an authorized absence? Uh, I how much? Off, but One to a hundred, let's just say. Abandonment of my post. One to a hundred. How much? Besides, you guys need someone familiar with the Divination Commission to show you the way, right? Then let's go. Darth Vader, okay. So you with the dark What's side. What's going on? Oh, what is, is that? Nice me, okay? I'm oh no. A, I'm a little scared. Uh That's wrong. That is very wrong. Yes. Uh well guess what? Speak, not hate. I just got my hands on what the original and signed. Is everyone okay? Books. 
the original. First ones, first five. I also got a couple, but they're not originals or signed. I got the collectible ones. Ah, uh, was... that's why I was late, by the way. There is only one way. Divination is meaningless. How did the Matrix of Prescience become like this? Look, Diviner Foe is standing at the center of the Matrix of Prescience. What is she doing? Judging by her chanting, I think she's performing navigation calculations. Or divining. But something's not right. The Matrix of Prescience oh, isn't moving She's worried about the spirit surrounding the the human monster Vora was transformed into slugging in the hand Sydney. A Heliobus? Is that the danger Nuts. you were talking about? <laughs> I read about them in a book. Starfire essence that can transform itself. Enjoys manipulating the dreams and desires of mortals. You mean the Master Diviner is being controlled by something like that? How can we snap her out of it? Well, here's the thing. Uh, I we just... We try ringing the harmonic chime. If we're close enough, uh, we should be able to enter the Heliobus's illusion. After I uh, saw it was authentic and all of that, I went over to a place that can seal it so I can preserve it. Because I'm obviously going to be preserving that thing. Why wouldn't I? Silence! Idle chatter is not permitted in the Divination Commission. Master Diviner! You're awake! Or perhaps we should call you Caroloom! It doesn't matter what you call me. I am the master of the Divination Commission. The current divination has reached a delicate stage, and no one is permitted to disturb it. Not even a judge of the Ten Lords Commission, or a guest from the Astral Express! Ching Chue! I have grown weary of your insubordination! Are you the one who brought these outsiders into the commission? Have you turned a deaf ear to all the rules I've laid down? Ching Chui, you are hereby expelled from the commission. I... Th that's... Turn, now we're down one person. A great idea! Uh, okay. <laughs> My days here really have been unproductive, loafing around outside and playing Celestial Jade, all while taking a Divination Commission salary. It's... how to put it? They can't... You can that later. I probably turns to give it a 10. Not exactly. I do complete all my assigned work on time. Okay, that's at least good. <laughs> I would call it Side of my own. wasting my life away. Uh, Thank you, Master Diviner, for giving me the push I needed. Since the one in the shadows, the people that watch with, and observe everything. To think about making some changes. I don't really like going into battle, but if I was to choose the side, oh my gosh, I, I, well, under technicality. I would be wanting to be the person that shoots that giant laser. Yes. Or be the per- yeah, the giant laser one. I, I like the giant laser. Firing my laser. And before I leave, I have to help these guests take care of some trouble here at the commission. If I don't, people will think I was fired because of cowardice in the face of danger. Damn. What next? What do we do? <laughs> Giving a dramatic speech to my boss was cool and everything. But, but yeah, the dark it's not side. Not gonna help her break free from the heliobus clouding her mind. Mainly because I like the black. I like all the black. Like I'm currently wearing black shirt, black pants, black gloves, um, black hat, black socks, everything. I'm not sure what to do. The Heliobus isn't trying to trap us inside the illusion, and it doesn't look interested in attacking us either. Clouding my mind? 
I've never been a clearer mind than I am right now. From now on, I will dedicate myself to defining the predetermined futures um. of the C and Joe Alliance, and will make these futures known to the world so that all can live in clarity. I think you've gone on the deep end, cause. I know what you want to say. Spare me the lecture on uh, human yes. wisdom prevailing over nature and those ridiculous uh, notions of free will. Star Wars character, created by the obviously. Brain. From the beginning, um, there was only one path. His co-pilot is Chewbacca. You are nothing more than a pawn at the mercy of a Stellaron hunters. What day you boarded the express? Who your enemies are? And where yes. you go? Wait, if you these choices wait, that you think you make free you know of your own accord he, are mere tributaries. Uh, I don't want to spoil anything, but I think people have already watched the part where he uh, goes away. Joe, I will say. Feet of Fantilia. All these were written into a script long ago by that slave to destiny, hidden in the shadows. Even in this very moment, your options are few. Ready your bat and charge at me. Argue with me loudly and futilely, or fall into silence. <laughs> Don't I let her words it. get to you. There Why are wouldn't I know? I, it's obvious. Uh, she would turn loudly and go into silence. Well. Ready my bet. The rise and fall of the tides are dictated by the fire trigram and the water trigram. You are powerless against such a force. You have no hope of defeating me. I have no hope, you say. Venting your anger is meaningless. Anger cannot change that which is already ordained by destiny. All offense, no defense. Is that your strategy? Your attacks won't land on me. Only on these innocent puppets. Damn. I'm glad we're all out of Such place. trivial choices cannot change the inevitable. If you are still not convinced, I can demonstrate to you the true nature of destiny. In a way that your human brain can comprehend. Sure. <laughs> okay, sounds good to me. <laughs> oh, the robot guy. Yeah, okay, I can't use any assistance. I should go. What is this? This place is what the Divination Commission calls the Pathfinder. Oh yeah, we just did a mission on that. Game, the diviners used to simulate future paths and exercise our minds. But why did the master diviner bring us here? That's right. Now listen. If you place an ingenium in this little maze and give it a command, it will find its way to the exit precisely as it was commanded to do so. Are humans not the same as they navigate the path of destiny set before them? But you're probably thinking, humans are not machines. There is more than one path in the universe. And yet machines we are. Complex, sophisticated, but we are just like the Ingenium in this maze. We have no options to speak of. We can only navigate one path. The one that takes us to our destination. Let's begin. Mm. Lead the Ingenium to the exit. Show me how many choices Destiny gives you. It feels like we're dancing to the Heliobus's tune. Okay. Just a second. Oh, my, my cousin's talking to me. Mm. There we are. Um, can I just not pop my way in here real quick? Modify the arena. Beforehand, to know this, um, forward. 
Wait a minute. Why? Nothing. Forward, you can go left. Bring down. Side. So, up, left, down, right. Up, left, down, right. Let's begin. That change. What? Left up. Your choices are as the Omnisia foresaw them. You should know that there was only one answer to this puzzle from the beginning, just as destiny has only one path. Yes, for a puzzle that was designed from the start, choosing any other path would be a pointless mistake. But the universe isn't someone's game, and no one is designing puzzles for us to solve. The universe doesn't have a single answer. We can do it's anything true. we want while we're in it, even if it's the same work every day. I can hide in the library and read a book, or find someone to play Celestial Jade with. And that's freedom. I never thought slacking off could convince me of anything. Sign <laughs> ah. a true scholar, a diviner of the Divination Commission, after all. Sushong, snap out of it! A slacker Heliobus is getting into your head. <sighs> ching chue, ching chue. For you, life may have a seemingly infinite number of choices. That is because your choices are simply different ways of slacking off and wasting time. They are of no consequence to anything. But for me, choices come with very real consequences. Mm. <sighs> That's the most divinery thing you've said so far. As the right. master diviner of the La Fu, I have a heavy responsibility. Mm. I must comb through the complex threads of destiny day after day, all for the preservation of this giant ship. Some paths look promising, but lead to an abyss of despair. Then there are small trails that plunge deep into unimaginable darkness. And in the end, I realize that we have no real choices. There is only one path to follow, only one way to the optimal solution. No, even not really. Even if it is paved with ashes and bitterness. Not really. There's multiple ways to end in one location. And in some ways, favor it better because then you know more experience. Like, let's just say I wanted to get to, I don't know, from... Let's just say I'm currently at, I don't know, in, like, let's just say Australia is me. And I want to get to America. I can either go to a direct way, I can either go like of a long way right or long way left. That I have more experience with the other two ways, but the one if I go straight ahead, I just do it quickly. Not there is only one way, and there only ever was. What do we do? I don't think we can persuade. I have a proposal. Why don't we try a more advanced Sanfa? However long you want to play this game, and whatever tricks you try to pull, I'll happily play along. <gasps> Miss Jingtre! Use your free will to guide the Ingenium out of the sandbox. This is a bit more difficult. Let's begin. Lead the Ingenium to the exit. Show me how many choices destiny gives you. That's quite literally up, left, down, right, up. But can I do it differently? The way to go up is from there. One, two, three, four, three. That is the only way. One, two, three, four, five. 
needs to be a lot more complex. The path changed slightly, but it was just as simple. I'm sure the Master Diviner would say, Destiny only has one path. Your choices are just a predetermined solution to the puzzle. Actually, I don't think I agree. Master Diviner, let's reset the sandbox and give it another go, shall we? Again? Do it all over again exactly as it was? You can try it a million times over, and a million times over it is doomed to the same fate, because there is only one path. <laughs> I see what you're thinking, Ching Chue. You're an interesting one. Ching Chua, I've been thinking through the calculations for this puzzle. There really is only one solution. This maze was designed by Caroloom. It's no use. There aren't any other solutions. As long as we're playing this so-called game of destiny, we can't win. No, there's a second choice. There will always be another choice. Miss Trailblazer, quick, say something to persuade her. Ready to begin? Of course there's another solution to this sandbox. Listen to my idea. You're all gonna help, right? Miss Chingtra, I don't know how you're planning to solve the puzzle, but I'll support this squad to the end. Count me in. I'm sure Miss Chingtra has something up her sleeve. If we can help, I'm in. I only need two people for my plan to work. Oh, I see you. You go stand in the sandbox. Right about that spot over there. Stay put. Next, Judge Huoho, you stand on the other side of the room. And stop shaking. Great. I know. All right, we're ready. And now the second path appears. It Let's did begin. It did. Awaiting input. Wait, what? Okay, let me just. Okay. One, two, three, four, no, five. Then why is that one there? Ah, oh, yeah. One, two, three. This is the other solution, the alternative choice. Mm -hmm. I created a new solution. Master Diviner, you're not the only one who can design a puzzle. And I don't tread the path of destiny alone. <laughs> you think that by calling on your companions for help, you created a new path out of thin air? You're just playing with semantics. I could weave a thousand routes for you, but they lead to the same destination. So what significance is there in having a choice? Yeah. Creatures like you don't understand humans. The universe is like jade tiles on a game table. When the tiles are shuffled, the outcome is already predetermined. Which tiles can be played? Which tiles are left over? What kind of hand the person next to you is trying to make? All of these can be determined through calculations. But if everything is just a calculation, the game loses its flavor. Randomness and adaptability, ambushing your opponent, twists and turns, the balance of the elements. It's a mix of calculations, unknowns, and loss of complete control that makes Celestial Jade the kind of game it is. And those are the same things that give life its color and vibrance. Nice. Do my choices at the game table mean nothing if I have a sure loss in front of me? No. The choices are what make the game meaningful in the first place. 
Even if I lose, I'll still make choices to lighten the loss. Just like the Master Diviner is making choices for her own agenda. Yes. You were right when you said that as Master Diviner, you must comb through the complex threads of destiny day after day, all for the preservation of this giant ship. In this vast universe, a game where there are only losers, our Master Diviner is making endless choices, fighting against the odds just so the Lawful can travel safely for another day. <laughs> In my book, she's the best player there is. That's very cool. Why would someone as talented as the Master Diviner go through the trouble of making endless choices if the end result is predetermined? Heliobus, you cannot fathom the joys of humanity. You are imprisoned by the illusion of destiny, unable to free yourself. And you want everyone who peeks into the future to suffer the same pain as you. You don't understand humans at all. Don't let them trick you, Fu Xuan. Don't push me away. Don't let her word fool you. Kiriloom, release the Master Diviner! Yes. I see through your trickery. I see through everything. Oh, no. I'm going to lose. Victory is beyond my reach. Why? Exactly. Why is there no alternative? Everything in this universe is predetermined. No, I... I had no path to victory. Wait, what? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. To the class. I know, 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 I know. By the order of the Ten Lords, execute the Mara Struck! Do you admit this crime? Um, no. The wind is rising. Both from the blow. I can't hurt me. Definitely restoration. Let's make it quick. This spirit never dies. I'm gonna score myself. Exactly why. I 
if he knows that this is going to be a failure, then why does he continue? Stay the course. By the order of the Ten Lord, execute the Marastruck! Perfect, though. Just a small headache, nothing more. Okay, good. It's normal to experience some discomfort after being possessed by a heliobus, but nothing a few medicinal pellets can't take care of. Uh, is that Carolum? <laughs> they may not be the most powerful fragment, but becoming entangled in- Hurry! I didn't click it! Just hurry up and see me in the darkness. I've foreseen what happens next. You're going to imprison me. Yep, indeed. I am indeed. Xing Jue. Thanks to you, the Divination Commission is safe again. Thank you. No need to thank me, Master Diviner. By the way, while you were possessed, you fired me from the Commission. So... That counts, right? I'll have to ask you to give me written notice that my contract has been unilaterally terminated. Then, with all the years I've spent in the Divination Commission, I'll be able to get a great severance package. Yeah. And I already planned what to do with all the money. I'm gonna open a gaming parlor, hire a couple of workers to run it, and spend the rest of my days living off the profits. I'll have started a new life without having lifted a finger. <laughs> Are there two Ching Chues? Uh, I see. <clears throat> what a pity. I don't recall anything I may or may not have said while possessed by the Healy of us. Uh, in any case, Ching Chue, why are you still here? Shouldn't you be on duty back at the repository? Huh? M Master Diviner, you can't back out! Seriously? Of course I can. After all, there are always choices in life. You taught me that. Okay. I can't convince real you, let alone possessed you. Master Diviner, you should get some rest. I'm gonna go take a br I mean, get back to work. <laughs> okay, that's actually kind of funny. Is she a playable character, by the way? Let me check that out. Uh, Fujin brings herself to inspect the commission in My order to today brought great shame on the divination commission. At least no one got hurt, don't worry. It's the only witness in the group. Hmm. I shall have to think of a way to keep her from talking. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay. Heliobi are good at finding people's weaknesses and exploiting them. Everyone has some uh, kind Xing of weakness. Shue. You're not to blame. Xing Shue, the lazy That's one. That's right. You were just a victim of the Heliobus's trickery, Diviner Fu. No need to blame yourself. I must express my sincere gratitude to all of you for your help. Apologies, but the Divination Commission is in disarray at the moment. I must I can't right now. In order. I can't right now. There's something we need to ask you. What is it? Mm -hmm. mm, I agree that the Master Diviner gets possessed wouldn't make for a good headline. I don't care how you spin the story, so long as you leave my name and identity out of it. Okay. <clears throat> Request list, events list. Events list? Talking about this here? Events and notes. Oh. Of this. Are you talking about this? Who I was talking about is. Ooh. Question beforehand Is this you? Is it? I haven't clicked it yet because there are some privacy things. No, okay. 
Well, if it's no one I know, immediately gets deleted. Uh, all event list. Okay, let me check that real quick. This is the event note. No, this one here? Is that what you're talking about? This is what? No longer there. What's no longer here? Did I miss something? Check my character list. Uh, my character list, like in characters, or if I was to go to data bank and check people. Yep. She is! She's a quantum as well. Rana draws one time. Oh, yep, I remember her gameplay. Never mind. I remember it. I remember it. Remember the tar thing where you do multiple skills? Yep, yeah, and that's like a like board thing. Then she gets like this three in a row thing. Yeah, I remember it. Mm. Shocking You have her for free, I did. I have many things to attend to. Please allow me to save my thanks for another day. Well, then that's we good, I guess. Any longer. <laughs> we need to go to fix I forgot her gameplay. But never mind, I remember it now. Won't be using her. Although I might level her up randomly, just because I can. But that's something for future. Memory stage three of Forgotten Hall. Oh, okay. The Matrix of Prescience ultimately. Not completed yet. There we are. Oh yeah, the Forgotten Hall. Yep, I'm gonna be upgrading like characters to all the way to the max. All the characters, all the way to the max. And then I'm going to be using it. Fights using merging like tiles. Yes. How she uses like playing games. Ex Expel evil and capture stray spirits with the support of the Ten Lords Commission Spirit Fairs. You seal the Heliobus within the Le Le Lenbra ground. Mm, it seems that your operations have met with some success. Yes. I've been browsing through some of the stories on Ghostly Grove myself. They make for good reading. As the saying goes, serious divination concerns serious matters. It is inevitable that someone performing divination day in and day out for the Sienjo would acquire inner demons, and Heliobus can take advantage of those. Fortunately, with your help, Fu Shren prevailed over her intruder. What if Junyo gets possessed? Oh no! That would be terrible, actually! Because she he already ha- no, he already has one! He can't get possessed! Remember the, the giant other one? He already has Do one, you remember? enjoy listening to storytellers and watching Immersion? In both cases... You can't get possessed by two. determined ending. But you shouldn't let that stop you from enjoying them, should you? The same is true of life. Whether the end is predestined or not, it's worth living. Very well, then. Miss Hanya is waiting for you by the suppression towers. I believe that is correct how I said that. Speak, not haste. In order to catch Helio Bio. My voice is peculiar, so 
smell coming from that person. I can't bear it anymore. Uh, okay. On behalf of the Ten Lords oh, Commission, yeah, I commend you for your great service in resolving the Divination Commission crisis. I will honor all of you before the Ten Lords. Thanks, Madam Hanya. But, uh, we really couldn't have defeated Carolyn without Miss Chintre's help. I didn't realize that one as skilled as Diviner Fu would also be susceptible to the power of the Helio Bai. That said, I can understand her plight. After all, we're all moving forward on our own unseen paths in no uncertain terms. Yep, that is true. Judges are instructed by the Ten Lords to carry out their orders, but no one ever explains their meaning to us. Just like the Master Diviner, no matter what cruel and horrible paths she foresaw, as long as it benefited the Lofu, she had to make a choice. Those choices may be correct and far-sighted, but we are, after all, flesh and blood, and we cannot help but agonize over the process of making them. Madam Hanya? I apologize. I was getting carried away. I think all the paperwork must have worn down my mental acuity. Today's business is finished. Please get some good rest. Right. Let's call it a day. And you oh, too, me. Judge Hanya. Don't work yourself to death. Isn't it's she already dead? Finally time to get back to bed. Goodbye, everyone. Seriously, Shishan? 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 Or the, the chef? Remember the sh- the hell? Why don't we start with half heart uh, and talk about what happened, what we did today? So I was still a hilly rescue and thanks to everyone who's helped. By the way, Miss Kim, yeah, looks so cool. True that. Yeah. Well, let me tell you something funny. A while back, I got this message from someone accusing me for plagiarizing uh, the shop review videos. They even threatened to take legal action if I didn't respond right away. I simply read, nah, my own stuff. Nah, it's my own stuff from last year. They argued. But that there's no statute of limitation for plagiarism. Whether I uploaded the video 10 years ago or 100 years ago, it should still count as plagiarism. That means you're famous now, little girl, me. And that's what I think, too. Why didn't we count? Uh, why don't you go check the fellow count? I'm feeling like I'm floating on cloud nine. Damn, you're in love or something? You've been floating there for a while. You've been floating there for a while. I'm saying that too. Don't forget to check it. Well do. Damn. <laughs> it means a lot more fast for trillion units. Oops. <laughs> Uh, did I just get like okay? That's on its way. I was going to look for the suits here. You can tell me. I'm going to go for the next one. You can tell me. Service. Challenger. Sixty. I'm selling all the surroundings, present hours, soon very secret from this cabin. Ooh, I will be definitely doing all of this. Mm. Okay, the hats. Do you have any plans on food? Mm 
Mm-hmm. I think there should be a follow-up interview in the line alpha server. There's another one? Okay. So, are you saying that ghosts are actually the spring of life after death? Science of death. Science for me. Okay. Um... Everyone see the link just now? That thing, I suspect it's haunted. I've seen this in Merger before. A dead bank employee protects his former girlfriend. Don't tell me it's actually real. Getting back on topic, when did... <coughs> when did going home become... Focused now? And also, that's really freaky. What's freaky? If it weren't for you, the fact that OP made up the whole thing, then I definitely say it was here by hunting. Some here by take advantage of the vi- victim's deeper desires to call forth all kinds of illusions. They torture their victims, detaining them of all emotion and desires, putting them in grave danger. I understand. Ghost hunting squad, move out. I PM the OP and sent the address. This is 300, please. Could you go check that out? I'll head after to take me. I think first looks like it's up to you. So think about it. Yeah, it won't. It won't take very long. I'll be there real soon. And that one. Unacceptable. Damn. I'm gonna get this one as well. I'm gonna do this. Start challenges. That's a new one. Use bounce attacks and flip the blue. I don't have bounce. Completely deplete all enemies' toughness and simultaneously deal damage to them while making the simulation. Okay. I'm just gonna do my normal layout. Yeah, when all that actually looks like it would do good damage. No down characters. No more than one time. Nice. Looks like it's in our hands currently. You could have surrendered. Kind of what I wanted, yeah. Do you admit this crime? This one. Stay the course. You are a problem. The wind is rising. Bolt! From the blow! I like that one. You could have surrendered. Let's make it quick. Huh. I'm scared. Stay put. Uh, <laughs> Oh, yeah. Dies. Ability, every one of these. You could have surrendered. <laughs> Rules are made to be broken. Okay. You 
You could have surrendered. Completely done. Would you look at that? That was easy, easy lemon squeeze. Challenge complete. Ooh, a little bit more difficult. I don't know if I'm able to defeat this in four. Break the wind. Gale force. It's time. Let's go. Yeah. for like the star. Oh no, I don't have a ultimate. The time is now. We mustn't delay. Damn it, he didn't die. Do you admit this crime? Let's make it quick. Mm. Huh. I'm scared. Stay put. I don't know where I'm going, stop. Damn it. Nah, you've got to be kidding me. I'm already under the target. I'm going to get down. No failing the challenge. Break the wind. Is that five thousand health? I'm okay. Uh. <laughs> OK. 
Okay. Do you admit this crime? Um. These are devils. I'll crush them all. Completely broken. This is our chance. Huh. Rules are made to be broken. Heck yes. The wind is right. Bolt. From the blow. Perfect dog. Challenge complete. Final challenge. Okay, this one. Still like this one. Break the wind. Um. Order of the execute the Mara struck. Let's make it quick. No one misses the Mara struck. Just a stretch. Never dies. Everything down. You could have surrendered. Mm. The wind is rising. Bolt. From the blow. You can't hurt me. Not exactly sure. Um, that's a song, is it not? Yeah, it's a song. What about it? And also, I don't even ask to play it. I will get copyrighted. for driving. It literally is of a guy driving, is it not? Is it not? Oh yeah, if you do the fuel switching. I can do it after this. <laughs> Having a lot more fun with the ghost hunting. Wait, so you're still That uh you are uh, Name is I'm not saying that. Little you sent you right. I thought you'd I'd be meeting up with her in person. It's like this. My neighbor is an old Foxian grandpa who lives by himself, called Wei Young. Wei Young is an introvert who keeps to himself and hardly gets to interact with anyone. But recently, at night, there has been a laughter coming from his place. Somehow, this guy has turned into a person filled with radiant joy. 
Once I bumped into him in the market and asked him about it. He told me it was his wife, Rose, Rose uh, finally coming home after 30 years abroad. All of this was covered already in your post. That's on me for waiting, for writing everything so clearly in my post. I didn't leave room for suspense. You should let me tell you the rest of the story. I remember when they married, they married as a neighbor, a graduate. I congratulated them in person. Unfortunately, these two did not live happily ever after. Ever heard of the great battle of Fengzhang, Fenghang, Fengha, 30 years ago. Was I, she sacrificed her life in that battle. And yet she was, and yet here she was again. I didn't actually believe in ghosts or anything, let alone coming back from the dead. I posted this on that spooky thread just because I didn't know whom to turn to for help. Unless she really is alive, unfortunately, it, it's not entirely impossible. Back then, her jade Akibos and death murders was both male back. Old when young, even held a false memorial ceremony as is custom. I remember it crystal clear. Naturally, you can't rule out the ring arbiters. Rainbow's Arbiter's protection. If she really is all safe and sound, shouldn't she have come back a little earlier? How can I find them? This morning I heard them say he was going shopping around the Aram Alley with his wife. You should be able to find him there. Damn. I got it. I asked the person who made the post and they said we could find them in a couple, the, find the couple in Aramali, sounds cool, nothing like fruitless investigation caught up in. I came across the post about an ancient poem all of a sudden playing around, mind for melody. It's what, come on, don't commune, Spence. Turns out Jay, acting on battle practice here, and Louise recently gave it a new battery. Well, that's typical, looks like. Luke Marina actually has found something really strange. Atlas Marina, I'm coming. Yep. Oh, doing this voice is hurting my throat. Like this voice here. Oh, that's okay. That is okay. I can do my new voice for well the episode. Thought that will just fall. Be a my guess because well, sounds dead. My voice sounded back to me is very dead. So I can just do a um uh customer service voice. Yes. Didn't you notice this Ming Rung and he doesn't even seem possessed. And this Heliobus is also quite unusual. Things have to have gotten more complicated than anticipated. Very simple. You're right, I'm just I'm I am a judge. I will capture the f fleeing Helio boss. Mm. I suppose very different from the Lofu that I know. Only you are the same. Aha, uh -huh, so are you. Just the same. Are you feeling to chat right now? Uh, so, we'd like to talk to the two of you. You have been sleeping. You may not even a blind person could tell what our relationship is. Don't you know? And I don't know what you are trying to do, but please leave my wife alone. You're the only one who's not a real person. Keep your mouth shut. Please don't embarrass us. We're just husband and wife out on a date. Brooks, I, you're too gentle with them. There's no need to be soft and kind hearted with these two hooligans. Dear, we shouldn't. Make a big scene out of this. This girl is a judge of the Ten Laws Commission. Uh, let's just pretend that any of the fences cause didn't happen. We're leaving here right now, okay? No, please wait. We're already completely interrupted by the human bus, so I can try using the trine. I don't really think I had it on me, wait a minute.
Don't yeah, look at me, please turn around. What are you doing? Done. Put you, put you up, Dookies. Hang on with one. Let me and her have a chat. So I can't hide anything from the judge's ten lawyers. Fine, you. Are you here to arrest me? Uh, don't you think I don't know that was too stupid to realize? Why did you have to lay it all out like that for? Brian didn't say that they were... They didn't... One young didn't say that they are from the Ten Laws Commission, so... They do things by the book, so you will voluntarily deceive. Yeah, I understand, but you are an actress. At first, I was like you. I said I disguised myself from San in the vain hopes of cheating him. But haha, Wang Young is a very smart man. He probably saw right through everything at first sight. These happy days we've been spending together have been nothing more than a tap game of playing house. Oh, this feeling is real. Once I thought, I once thought that. As a being of starfire essence, I never needed to love or be loved, but I was wrong. So beg you, please don't let me lose. Don't let me lose what we have only. No, don't let me lose what we have just gained, Miss Roxinger. If I'm not mistaken, Mr. Wormer has changed much since the two of you have met. I have noticed that despite not taking possession, you still unintentionally consume the host's body. You're right. I'm being selfish, Roxie. You don't, you know, I never cared about any of that, so I'll soon with away from exposure to a heavy bus. I already know that, lady. This is just what I used to research back in my days studying at the Zhang Zhang Hao Xingyin's Academy. I'm sorry, right from the very start, I should never have. Don't say that, seeing you one more time with the price paid by life. Time uh, by a lifetime of conserved luck, lady. I know you're trying to act according to the rules of Ten Lords Commission, but I am asking you to relax just once. Once I've spent our final moments together, she will definitely come to you. Yes, please give us a little more time, and then I'll I will do the fight. Go with you. It looks a little awkward. She hopes you can help her come to audition. Best. Do you respect their choices? I don't. I know the price to pay. I'll pay. I knew all along, so be it. Thank you. I know you have been given orders from the Tenders Commission. I sincerely appreciate your decision. Now, whatever, whatever happens is going to be my own decision and has nothing to do with you. You have to bear any guilt or shame about this. When you is really for the best, you really want to give up so much. I've already spent 30 long hard years waiting for you to come back. Maybe it will be, uh, it will, it, it'll be quick. Or maybe just take forever before I can finally find relief. But now you're back by my side. Not even, not even if you are really you. Even you, you're just a joke of fate. I am still happy. Thank you no matter what, who, no matter who you are, Ralph's eyes. We should get out of here. Goodbye, Miss Judge, and you too, lady. Come on! I can't read that! Are we? Is this for the best? How about going? Goodbye. This is not me. Let's go. Okay, so we just let someone die, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> oh, whoops. Not really a whoops, I knew what I was doing. Tell you about when you're in this situation. I see. How How doesn't know whether she was right or wrong, but when... But when... Is... She ever going to get a simple case of right and wrong in this world of ours? Anyway, the whole thing, thing's over and done with now. Let's post up to the ghostly grove, okay? Okay. 
to this one. I understand what you mean. I understand Miss Swingshin settlement. It's hard to accept someone leaving at this. I'm the same. Hmm. Don't be sad, how how. Let me let let me take you out to the spices, Supreme. No no, we still have lots to get done. Leave how how with me and leave the work to Liz Marina three hundred, isn't if Sung Hung were in, she'd be able to agree with me. Take me with you. Let's go, come on. Big can your food has always been has the power to cure a heavy heart. Nice. As for Warren Rosai, I'll trust they give you an explanation of their own. Yay! Your eternity. Ooh, so much. What a message. Mm. 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 Yeah, that's all. Okay. Yeah. So I didn't get on time, but I'll treat you next time. I remember that. Very, very different. The calm is a witch, not a not the beware. I can give you mine to you. I can. It's yours. I'm sorry. The two teas fell on the ground and spilled. Don't worry about getting. I'll trick you. Yay! 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 <laughs> How do they know Paimon? Achieved. She's like, look at this. Look at this case. And that. Even there's a chance to observe how that works, who would be. Fam, have you seen the news? It's huge. I, I've already thought of the plot for the next ghost story. The title will be. Uh, not bad, not bad. You're pretty good at this. My opinion, Oliver should be behind this incident too. Do you remember that? True. Heroes finally exploded into the into a rain of fire down from the sky. Beautiful prize in the sky. Is it possible these originate from all the fleeing fragments back from back then? The tail might be among them. If it's really a heliobus causing trouble in the sky, who among us can fly? I'm sure the Ten Lords Commission has a way, right, how? Being a judge of the Ten Lords Commission doesn't really doesn't really let you fly. This is bothersome. If the Heliobus fragments are hiding in the sky, we are we supposed to wait for them to fall? Let me think. What should we do? I have an idea, Liz Marina three hundred. Can you come with me? I thought of something. I was expected from the Ten Lords. I heard from Haya that Hao Hao has been very good. 
at organizing the props for the Ten Lords Commission, so she, she's no less of an expert. No, no. Hmm. Do, don't praise me like that. We'll get back to work then. Contact us if you if you have any questions. Yay! Where am I going? All the way up there. Bro. Before that, there's like these things like flying around that I want to listen to. Besides, that's a different body. The why you said the current one suits you since he's rich, she loves a luxurious life and enjoys staying home. Isn't that perfect? Right. But he's a Viadra. Ooh. There's always a smell in his body. I can't take him along. What has that got to do with being a Viadra? I often miss it. He often misses the ancient sea, so he pours his soul into to his bath daily and claims as a scent of sea. Nah, man. Whoops. I would have enough too. Um. Okay. Let's just go quickly. Okay, I'm not let's get this up. I'm gonna be on squirrely. I mean, this is his. So, what do we tell me? only left me around. I'm going to like this at the bottom times. Finally, stayed a square. I've had it for ages, but you're the only one in the world. It's such a good point. It's such a good point. Oh, good point. Are you saying that I should go into town? Yeah, please don't. Just kidding. Don't be scared. It's only if it's only in a forsaken place like this. Tennis Commission can turn a blind eye to me. Oh, to be honest, singing to nobody here is really boring. Damage. All right, let's land. Ah, uh, what? Ah, uh, not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. I'll do that another day. Heliobot, not ghosts. I'll do that another day. I think that's like a side quest thing, like right here. I'll make sure to remember that. I'll do it after I do this. XD. Oh, hi, Alex. Ooh, you found me. Let me think. What favor can I give you? Why do you want to do a favor for me? I say part of mine. It may be a bit stinky, but it's also very useful. What has been tenuous meeting you and I were destined to meet. Yeah, here's a little something for you. You're welcome. So, that's great, everyone loves surprise like this. No, actually, based on personal experience, there are some who don't. May I ask why is that you just like my method of entrance? Oh, let's see. I'm just repeating another person's behavior get unfairly tagged by being uncreative humans that sure are an interesting species but intelligent. Well, I'm an entrance in that sunny current, instead of spiral off into the sky, sparks and fireworks. Is that okay? It's not as simple as it. If someone else didn't like her, you would just stop breathing, wouldn't you? What? <laughs> we tell storytellers not to tell the stories that. Mm -hmm that someone has already told it for, they'll feel hurt or start doubting themselves. Pity, you're the only, you're only asking a helio bus. I'm Melly the Imp, Imp, and I'm not going to stop doing something just because a human doesn't like it. <laughs> Enjoy the gift, okay, bye. Well.
Judge Powell, Victoria Crane, you need it is ready. Still, I'm still not used to be addressed as judge, but thanks. Judge here. This, this is a flying Lombarda Grod mobile platform, aka Exorist Crane, you requested for Judge How How. Comes in a pack, comes, it comes with a carrier package. It's very observant of you, the Lombarda Guard is the courier package. Whatever fulfills the purpose flying with the Lombarda Guard, I guess, actually is pretty easy to operate. I usually say... Anyway, this crane is at the disposal of Judd Haha among us who do we have anyone who knows how to operate a crane? You notice the two of them looking your way, looking at you instinctively. That's me. Um, are you ready to pilot the crane? Crane, stop! Connecting. Thumbs up. I suppose that ver verifies the feasibility of the exorcist crane, Judge How. I'll please return in a timely fashion after using it. I will, let's get moving this Marino 300, we should take a look at the place mentioned in the post. We shall. Here we are. It should be a Heliobus, are you ready? Crane, start! The two best to be unbelievably advised in less than 10 minutes. Okay. But there must be word. Yeah. Seems he is. Catch me if you can, kiddo. Is it an eye? No, it isn't. But it's not over yet. You're fighting a crane? Spirit never dies. What is this smite? Okay, I will try to blast him. Uh, you could have surrendered. Ooh. Let's make it quick. Oh. Uh, What? Ah, uh, think that's useful? The yeah, Arachno mean, stops fleeing and returns to the ground. Not bad, girl. This is the most exciting adventure I've ever had. W what's your name? In what's your intention? I'm just out to have fun. If you're the one being locked in the fur uh, if you're the one being locked in the furnace, you find ways to escape from that boring place too. To be able to enjoy myself like this, I guess there's nothing I'm unhappy about. If you get if you got the nerve, then don't let me escape again, or else I'll shut up and go and go in. Ha ha. Oh look, me. Phew. We finally settled this troublemaker. There should be only one location left. Ah. Uh... 
March, March. Is a Helia by near you? Ah, am I seeing things? There should be a Helia by here, right? Let's go quickly and take a look. You rush to March 7th side. Ah, Ms. Marino, who's this? Greetings, I'm Hal Hal from the Ten Lords Commission. Did you meet any, uh, strange occurrence? Strange occurrence? No, but I did manage to capture some beautiful shots of the scenery. How about this? Take this talisman you to you. If there's something that happens to you, it will react. Oh, part pass the talisman to watch something. Nothing happens. Does it mean I'm fine? I suppose so. Leaving us, March. Since, since she said so, I'll take it as if nothing happened. You should. Miss March, don't worry. In any case, you'll return to Fo- We'll return to- to Foxtel Garden in this thing in La Bra or I need you to to be restrained. We're restraining March seventh. You see my pictures, no bad. Let's -a go, Mario. Let's go, me and Mario. It's well, yep. We've seen this before. That hilly bus names Staffa. Staffa said it left the creation furnace for freedom. Do you think other hilly by? Are the same. Are you worried that you you wish right, that you were staying? Yes. Perhaps I don't know to anyway, let's publish the post and put the people at ease. Even though we did not find any clues about the tale, I'm still grateful for you. I will continue to search for tail. It is much stronger than Starfire. I'm sure I'll be I'll be fine. Yes, nothing will happen to it. And here's the post. Yes. Four hundred thousand fans. There's two to three. Begin investigation. Let's go. Hey, we're Helio by not goats. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Because I'm currently not. Because I'm currently not there. I can do this. I can uh, start off with the background story. Winning wine tells story. Man seduced by. Kill of us than the story. Ooh. Grandma Lee's a charming but deadly Hilly of us, luring the man into marrying her before reverently feasting on the groom's emotion on the wedding line. Oh, what a cliche. It seems cliche from the modern perspective, a Hilly by of course takes no gender, but of course you humans have to wrap this arch type of a female so around the whole thing. But the opera dates back to three suffering era. And you can't deny the artistic merit based <laughs> on its restrictions at the time. Only stupid humans who love thinking but hate reading books do that. But let's get back to track here. Take part, what we are learning is the scariest scene in the whole opera. The female lead takes possession of her husband, so there's just one body there alone. But it takes the form of two. They perform this graceful dance. A human hit and a healing of us singing until dawn breaks. When people come visit the next day, all that remains is the withered husk of the husband's corpse. Here is how it goes. In devotion in my heart does yearn 
to be known by you I love in return. Candles flicker, casting shadows on the wall. My bones, the wick of my flesh, the fragrance call. Robes full, revealing my desire. In Huliros, ten our possessions to search shall tra transpire. At night we embrace one as one, so tight come tomorrow you take your flight. That's beautiful. Like that. To hear, thank you kindly. For that's all for class today, then don't mull over what you covered today. Next time we'll do our practical training. That's all for today. Another time, remember. Oh, we can go back? Is there rewards for people? I can go back to doing that. There's always this <laughs> and here we are. I don't think searching like this is the best way. Diner haunted. Evil spirit breaks into restaurant and eats double its body weight in food. Oh, do you think Tail did this? Seems like his style. <laughs> Sounds like a very hungry criminal came up with a very poor excuse. What about this one? Uh, paranormal activity reported at exclusive horror immersion. Guests experience haunting within seven days of screening. It reminds me of when I used to watch horror immersion to train my courage. Whenever there was a suspenseful moment, Tail would jump up and scare me. Guys, I feel like this is just some sort of prank, or a marketing stunt to boost ticket sales. Guahua has been browsing Ghostly Grove for hours. Every time she finds a suspicious incident, she says, Do you think Tail did this? Problem is, any suspicious incident could be Tail-related when you think about it. True. <laughs> I feel like Tail is still around. Oh, but if so... Why didn't he come back to see me? It's because of the barrier around. <laughs> he was your tail for so many years. I'm sure he'd come back to say hi. Or bye. <laughs> anyway, even if you don't find tail, you're still a great judge. The success of our ghost hunting squad proves it. I, uh, thank you, Miss Gray. I, I don't really get compliments. Without the encouragement of you squad members, <clears throat> working with you guys has made me feel a little more confident. Oh, but it's hard not to think about the days when Tail was still around. I definitely should go into voice acting. Back then, I was a useless coward. I'd hide at the first sign of trouble. Tail would always complain about it. But he'd also get me out of danger. Hmm. <laughs> Reminds me of me and my brother. Sort of a love-hate relationship. Hey, look at this! Did you find Tail? Oh my gosh. Hey, look at this! I got to find Kong doing unthinkable. Doing the unthinkable. Doing the unthinkable. Uh, 162,000 followers? I wish it was that easy to get followers and Is like stuff. Something Tail would do? Tail or no Tail, it's definitely the work of a Heliobus. Let's hurry up and get to the scene. There'll be trouble to pay if we're too late. Let's be go. Be careful, everyone. This sounds like a very aggressive Heliobus. Yeah, sure. Does. Sword essence. Okay. Um. You know what? All of this will literally just be on the clue or something. I won't be able to remember all of this, all the little things. Won't be out at all. Unless I go back on the recording and go check everything, which is probably something that would do. Um, <laughs> don't be foolish. Oh, I'm gonna duel you, boy. I just learned a new technique. I'll use it to end your life. Unauthorized personnel should keep their distance. It's dangerous here. Act 
actually, we're not really unauthorized, are we, Judge? Is that Su Shang? And a judge? Why are the Ten Lords Commission here? It's a very long story, so let's deal with the problem at hand first. Mr. Cloud Knight, sir, the Ten Lords Commission will handle this. Thank you for your cooperation. Understood. Please, take mercy on him. Don't worry, this sort of thing is our specialty. Here's a lead. See how you like this. Oh, what does it hurt? <clears throat> Stay the course. Uh, didn't I already just... Why does that keep regenerating so fast? Can I change it? I would like to change it. You should do the praised Falcon. Judge Hua Hua, is he? His life isn't in danger, but his hands and feet are spasming, and his speech is incoherent. I think he's experiencing a delusion that he can't snap out of. I feel like I've been drained of my strength. Mr. Cloud Knight, sir, are you okay? Can you answer a few questions for me? Do you remember what happened to you? I... I think so. Let me think for a moment. Ugh. I received a report today about... an infestation of abominations here at the Alchemy Commission. The, the captain sent me to clear it out. What happened after that was... like a dream? I, I can't explain it. My weapon suddenly started talking to me. It, it taught me fighting techniques, which moves to avoid, which moves to use, which stances to adopt to retain balance. Then it told me to relax and let it take control against the enemy. That sounds just like a heal. I, I followed its instructions. To my surprise, it felt like my combat skills had greatly improved. Still, it told me I was incompetent, like a piece of rotten wood. It wanted to find a new apprentice to carry forward the art. It was only then that I realized there was a sword-wielding child beside me, staring right at me. Lots of children grow up learning to use a sword on the La Fu, but for a child to be walking around with one... I sure hope we're not thinking of the same person. I realized the boy was the general's retainer, Yin Sheng. Oh, okay. <sighs> I knew it! When I heard my sword say the name, <laughs> I was in disbelief. And then, for some reason, I just... Attacked Yin Sheng. <sighs> he, he must have spared me. <laughs> the funny thing is that I didn't even see him move. Damn. I just fell straight to the ground. Damn. What happened next was even more outlandish. Yin Sheng looked like he was talking to the sword in his hand. He turned around and left without oh, looking no. back. And my weapon? My weapon never spoke again. Not good. I'll take care of the Cloud Knight. You go after Yin Ching. Oh no. You have got to be kidding me. Not him. This is gonna be a bit bad. Oh well. Deal with it. Oh wait, what? Did I seriously go on the wrong side after all of this? 
So it switches by. I heard that Yan Ching's sword is a famous weapon crafted by the Artisanship Commission. It resonates with its master, reacting to his movements in battle like it has a mind of its own. He must have encountered some kind of danger, and his sword flew away to find someone to help, right? <laughs> danger? Miss Shang, don't scare me like that! What kind of evil would be strong enough to pose a threat to Yan Ching? I'm not sure, but the Helio Bai are strange creatures. Even the sharpest sword can't cut them. Uh-oh. I just had a thought. If it's not auspicious, you best not say it out loud. Based on what that Cloud Knight said, it isn't that Yan Ching's in danger. Exactly. Follow the sword. No matter what, we have to find Yan Ching before things get even worse. Great, more running. She's gonna make a comment about it. Bet. Not haste. Ah, uh, uh, I thought you go faster. No one place you can really be. Yeah, this. Huh? No. So. You're going somewhere. You might as well. Come. for Dragon Prayer Terrace. Judging by the sword's behavior, that's where Yan Ching is. Should we really be charging over there? Even without a Helio bus, Yan Ching is a swords master among swords masters. Uh, are... are you scared, Su Shang? Me too. Compared to the other Helio Bai we've dealt with so far, this one seems like it could do some serious damage. It does. Scared? <laughs> My mother taught me swordplay as soon as I could walk. I might not be as good as the general's apprentice, but I would never let cowardice dishonor the name of what I am. Whoops. Worried. I'm sorry. <laughs> if the Heliobus possessing Yanqing is too strong, I'm afraid I might not be able to guarantee everyone's safety. The general has been supporting our ghost hunting squad from the very beginning. It's time to return the favor. Even if it wasn't for the general's sake, as a judge, I can't let a Heliobus take over someone as dangerous as Yan Sushang. Mm -hmm. Miss Kuei, Miss Trailblazer, please help me rescue him. Right, let's Yan go. Ching is at Dragon Prayer Terrace. <laughs> let's go. Oh no. Let's go. Oh, what is this? Well, I'm officially going to die, like, completely. Bam. I want to face it. No, not face it, you guys. Seriously. What are uh, all these swords doing in Dragon Prayer Terrace? It must be be a Heliobus illusion. Shouldn't we ring the harmonic chime and see if we can talk to Yen Ching inside the illusion? Illusion? Since each of you can see it, wouldn't that mean you'd fallen into the illusion as well? <laughs> Don't be alarmed. To me, this sword formation is a precious arsenal. When I gaze upon any one, a thousand sword fights dance before my eyes. The sword play far exceeding anything I have learned. And better yet, they welcome those who wish to pursue higher realms with open arms. Just a second, I
Yeah. Okay. Ah, uh, that's not good. Okay. The general? You lie. I've already finished my assignment at the Alchemy Commission. I have no further orders. This is my own time. I came here to learn from Master Apira. To learn from these swords. Apira? That Heliobus's name is Apira? Correct. Master Apira promised to show me the flaws in my swordplay and how to take it to the next level. That's why I brought them to Dragon Prayer Terrace, where I suffered my most serious setback. Young one. With me, everything will be different. And I will annihilate you from this world. Whether it be Imbibit or Lune, the Stellaron Hunters or that woman, your accomplishments will exceed them. You will be matchless without limits. Damn. Matchless without limits. <laughs> You're just in time. The swords have taught me something already. I'd like to see how sharp my skills have become. Well, let's just hunt you know, your ass and get eat within first 30 minutes, I would say, because I will be pretty slow at defeating him. My skills are lacking. I've been through countless defeats. But with the Pyra as my master, no longer. I feel like it's like a lot, you see her? Spirit never dies. Just a scratch. Sincere Lieutenant Yen Ching, snap out of it! We don't want to fight you, but I want to fight you! And we're just getting started. Whoa, what? <laughs> Their skills are nothing compared to mine. What can I learn from any of them? Bro, it's a scripted loss. Then why not hack them down right? them down? I thought we were just sparring. The laws of the battlefield are no different from the laws of the universe. Life for victory, and death for defeat. Swordsmanship is the art of victory. And yeah, only the fine, victorious man. swords can be passed on. Swords defeated are buried among the barren wastelands. But... You're resisting me? <sighs> Rid yourself of these needless notions of clemency. How can you move forward without casting these distractions aside? Raise your sword. <laughs> Life for victory and death for defeat, huh? All this talk of laws of the battlefield and the universe. You think that gives the appearance of a grandmaster? You're just using someone else's ambition to satisfy your own desire to shed blood. This Xuan Yuan sword in my hand has been passed down through my family for generations. 
When my mother gave it to me, she said, the bread may bake, but the heart remains. And for a long time, I had no idea what she was talking about. I have no idea what you're talking about right now. Today, I just realized I misheard her. I think she actually said, the edge may break, but the heart remains. Probably. The Lieutenant Yinching, the winner and loser of this battle, have yet to be determined. Don't give me that. There is no point in fighting any longer speech. <laughs> this little wench's fighting spirit is on fire. Young one, since she insists on fighting, will you give her our answer? Ooh, ow, I'm not just his. Ow. I, I won't back down. And you shall die. This is between fellow Cloud Knights. Losing a fight isn't a big deal. But if I abandon it's a my one fellow soldiers one? and bring dishonor to the knights, how could I wield my sword again? Granted, I might not last more than a few moves. You guys go get the general, quickly! I'll try and hold him off until he gets here. Seriously? You almost killed me. I hate scratched losses. My bestie. Why is she so stubborn still? That was pretty freaking cool. I hate scripted Spirit losses. Told me that the general is still in Fixtral Garden. Let's hurry. I think the only one that can break Yan Ching's illusion is Ching Yan himself. <laughs> in the battle warehouse and blasted five song. Now, watch, oh, watch. Any small move basically can kill me. Who of us is at for now? Like, damn, why did it need to be? Hey, bruh. Is something the matter? You seem out of breath. I know, I just teleported here. Hmm. A helio bus that creates illusions for the sole purpose of instructing someone in swordplay. <laughs> I wouldn't mind learning a few tricks from them myself. Unfortunately, it sounds like this one is a little too aggressive to be a decent sparring partner. This is not an adversary that someone as young as Yen Ching is equipped to deal with. General, we need to move fast. If we wait any longer, I'm afraid that Sushan might be... I can understand your sense of urgency. But before I leave, I have a question for Cirrus. Naturally. Among the Heliobi, Pyra manifests the courage and warring spirit of Ignamar. They are the most aggressive of all the fragments. But who is this Swordmaster? Who is Yin Ching? Okay. My apprentice. <laughs> oh, no wonder I smell a hint of sadness in you. In order to rescue his incompetent apprentice, the master must fight on the battlefield himself. I must say, I'm very envious of Abira. You'll know the flavor of sadness, but not its meaning. An apprentice obsessed with victory and defeat has lost his mind to a helio bus and is now trying to shortcut his way to mastery of the sword. <laughs> then you should hurry. Pyra has an insatiable bloodlust. Once they've enslaved your mind, they can make you turn against your friends, your kin, even your own master. Go! I don't wish to delay your death match with your apprentice. Come on, how about we lost that anyway? Bullcrap. Crap, I tell you. Don't worry about our beyond simple emotions. Simple and trivial emotions. A lieutenant of the Seed of Divine Foresight. Is that the best you can do? 
And I was thinking I'd be done for the moment you drew your sword. I didn't think... I didn't think I would last this long. I... I'm not half as bad as I thought. No one you're hesitating again. You're always hesitating. Your opponent is no match for you. Yet they have managed to fin- It's time to finish it. Only blood can cleanse the shame of the sword. He won't do it. General. Young one, your old teacher has arrived. Under his tutelage, you never experienced true failure. But after suffering your first major setback, your confidence in your swordsmanship has been faltering. You worry that the general is disappointed in you. You worry that you don't have what it takes to be the person the general wants you to be. Now, show him what I have taught you. He'll be very proud of your progress. Tell him that with your sword, you will bring victory to the Sienjo. Wait, is it gonna be a 1v1? With my sword. Yan Ching would never draw his sword on me to prove himself. I have confidence in him. This confidence is not a belief that he will win every contest. It is a belief that he will one day break free from the paradigm of victory and defeat and realize his true reason for wielding the sword. The pleasure of swordsmanship, the saving of life and the dispatchment of enemies. This truth must be discovered by himself. No one can teach it to him. Now is the time for him to take that step. General, I... Break free from victory and defeat? Those are just empty words to comfort the dead and the defeated. Think of your crushing defeat at Dragon Prayer Terrace. Think of how you felt then, teetering on the brink of death. If the sword of that Stellaron Hunter had pierced your flesh, you wouldn't be standing here pondering the meaning of victory and defeat. Now is the time to break all your chains. Draw your sword on your master, to the general who is trying to imprison you. Draw your sword! General, allow me to demonstrate my swordsmanship. I hereby challenge you. Apira, I challenge these swords to battle! Young fool, how Disappointing. Your accomplishments would have been limitless. But you've been led astray by empty idealism. None of that matters anymore. While teaching you, I studied your every move inside out. And now you wish to throw down the gauntlet. Very well. In your own image, and with your own techniques, I will teach you one final lesson. And again, I'll beat your ass. Your sword play, every stroke and sway, I've committed it all to memory. Now, allow me to demonstrate. Intent, how powerful I am. No, Yen Ching. Conceal your form and hide your intentions. Don't fall for their distractions. Understood. Do you admit this crime? <laughs> Never dies. It's time. 
dies by the order of the ten lords execute the mara struck rules are made to be broken you could have surrendered let's go i failed yeah just stop using your balls Heidi. one hit one stroke of luck, one victory. <laughs> Impressive. I am bested. Ew, it's about time we got this guy into the gourd. Uh, what? What are you talking about, my What? Huh? General. I know what you wish to say, Yanqing. We can move past the melodrama. <laughs> then, uh, to the rest of you, thank you for bringing me out of that daze. Especially you, Miss Sushong. Why does everyone that gets Heliobust love to apologize for it? You're the victim here. They're the ones stirring up chaos. Well, I don't know. It should be me thanking you for holding back during our battle. Or maybe, just maybe, it's due to a sudden skill improvement? Uh, don't you think? When you passed out in the key. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> right. Conscious Xuxiang is pretty badass. We're gonna need to get you a front page news story for this one. Heck, let's get some billboards! So, you've made it your daily mission to tease me, huh? No, 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 no. respect to this incident, what is your plan for posting on the Law Fu's ghostly grove? Since it concerns the seat of divine foresight, I am hoping you could... Well, about that. Let me discuss it with her first. Uh, so many people... Is everyone okay with this? Thanks for covering for me. I'm so embarrassed. All's well that ends well. We should hurry back and lock Apira in the evil binding matrix. They're a dangerous one. I'm afraid they might escape. Well then, Yen Ching and I will take our leave now. See you later, Olga. All right, let's get out of here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Looks like we also unlocked this one here as well. That was a big risk, Miss Sushong. Actually, I'm well aware of my own limits. If it weren't for Yanqing resisting that Heliobus, 
Maybe I wouldn't have been able to hold on until you brought reinforcements. Why does it say two things dirty? Come to think of it, we only needed one person to fetch reinforcements. Why didn't we get her to stay behind with you? And why didn't you ask? <laughs> it's kind of embarrassing, but I was caught up in the moment. I guess I never thought it through. <sighs> Sometimes I wonder whether your head screwed on right. <laughs> we need to take you to the Alchemy Commission for a checkup. Maybe, but my actions kept everyone safe, and that's what matters. Touche. Oh, I needed someone to look out for her, and little Gwei is just a civilian. You shouldn't be putting yourself in risky situations. As for her, she's a distinguished guest of the Seat of Divine Foresight. If anything were to happen to her, it could turn into a diplomatic crisis. Um. Now, you realize I'm a trailblazer, right? That's defeated a wasn't it a Stellaron? After weighing things up in my head, it made the most sense for only me to stay put. Uh, if I still had my tail, I wouldn't be slowing everyone down. Sorry, uh -huh. I, I didn't think it through. You were never a burden. It's not your fault, Mister Shang. It's just. <sighs> I've been wondering, uh, but how can someone average like me keep up with the affairs of the Ten Lords Commission without my tail? <sighs> Forget it. We should get some rest. There could be even bigger dangers waiting for us tomorrow. Here's the thing, you're just good. It's so fun. Okay. I'm exhausted. You were incredible, Miss Yun Sham. I didn't feel like I feel like that boy shouldn't didn't use his full strength at all. It's like a kind of willpower that can only be cultivated after experiencing countless battles. I don't understand you martial arts guys. I'm so tired, little girl. Maybe you should talk about count related stuff. I got lots of different gifts by sent by fans. Yay, 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 yay. I won't say yay. Nah, yay. Where's your young She's probably asleep. She's exhausted. She's probably asleep by now. Yeah, we are asleep. And there's the three of us celebrating. So just... Yeah, let's celebrate. Ta da! Nice. Surprised the phone stay at full charge. Mm. That was a lot of fans. But we still have 130,000 each to go. Ask me anything about it. Yes, do we have any external missions? No, we don't. Okay. Um, actually, yes, we do. Uh, what? We've got Let's Discuss, and we've got two missions here. Okay. Wait. Did I not... Did I somehow place it? Teleport over here and get the rewards. I wouldn't say they're basically free, but a new one. Alright, because I'm not going to to lay the action, but it is well done. Every time I meet you, it's really a voice in the country. That's good. But it's still kind of like, um, this one is here. This one's recommended. Where this one here completely destroys them. This one, this one, this one, this one. 
They should probably be upgrading the characters as well. Nah, I'll leave that for another time. Um. You're gonna call for another wolf. The wind is rising. Bolt! From the boat! Get out of here. You could have surrendered. Don't want you calling for another wolf yet. Wait a minute, what? Rules are I must have broken. the orientation wrong. No. As easy as that. Seriously, bro? You can't hurt me. That was terrible how I had that orientation. Yep. <laughs> Definitely hindered my resolve. Result. Let's get that attack boosting. I barely just got that. But I had to also waste another one of them. Okay, that's okay. believe I'm restoring everyone. Hex 
Yeah, I'll just get rid of it now. Drawing complete. This is actually really easy to be honest. To everyone, rules are made to be broken. Healing now. Yay. Uh-oh. 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 No one the What they can summon multiple moves. I need you to kind of get out of here. Thank you. Um, yeah. Rules are made to be broken. By the order of the execute the Marastruck. Stay the course. What about that? Looks like this video is just gonna be ghost hunting, huh? Oh yeah, there it is, ghost hunting squad job up. Let's discuss. Discussing something gets me 10k more. Right. Is everyone here? Then let's begin. If everyone could please turn their eyes towards me, I have an announcement to make. The last time I heard this kind of talk was back in the Cloud Knight's basic training. <laughs> Basically, I got a parcel recently, and when I opened it, there was a silver, suspicious, commemorative melodon from the Ghostly Grove website. Ooh! Ooh, this is like a the play buttons. Basically, you get a hundred thousand subscribers, then you will get this silver melodon. Oh yes! I'm just the one because gold medallion for a million silver medallion is quite valuable indeed. So after a million, there's got to be one for a hundred million. Right? I think there was. So I'm definitely going to do that. Why not? To put it another way, I've put all things out so much high quality content that the fan base of our account has been rapidly increasing. If you ask me, this is thanks to everyone's efforts, so that's why I've called everyone over. Congratulations, how delightful. Same to you. Me too. I've called everyone because I think uh, uh, I called everyone over because I think I we have equal share in this melodon. For each of us to form the indispensable part of a squad without everyone chipping in, there'd be there'd 
never be such a flashy program. That's why I want to give this Melodon to everyone. Just one Melodon? Hold on to it yourself. How are you going to give it away? Shimshon's right. You're the only one in this world that, uh, that uh, there's only one of these and it can't be split up. And anyways, this achievement is also impossible without your fan base supporting us. So that is correct. So after rackling my brains, I've decided to upload a video on my personal account on the Ghostly Grove as a, an appreciation speech as and also do an ask me anything segment with fans so I can give a little something back. I hope she can help out too, as she has lots of ideas and general and, and general knowledge. So can you help me choose questions, record content and stuff like being on camera together with me? Yeah, no problems. That's it then. If everyone should finish up with their uh, own stuff first, I'll arrange for you to shoot the video content later as for the f the fan qa segment i col i'll collect those up in a bit she can also can you also in a bit miss trailblazer can you please also see if there are any interesting questions Ooh. fireball special it's a Up to you to believe. Is that it? Is that it? An avalanche of questions overwhelms you. You almost get lost inside the social network that's sometimes witty, sometimes harsh, sometimes warm, and even sometimes touching. Coming back to your senses, you have come to reply on your own superior sense of morality and based and based on your understanding of Ging Yuan from the past few days you keep flipping through the options as the deadline for submitting questions approaches Ging Yuan asks for you to shoot up the location for the QA segment you pick out a few interesting questions before you go let me think why did, didn't we just shoot it over in Skarsky Haven Go ahead. Let's go. Looks wrong one. First off, achievement. Nice. Mission. Ooh, this is a reward. Heck yes. Yeah. I hope she. It's getting late. Uh, Where to now? What? What do you mean by I hope she? The question mark. What? What? You're here, all the equipment. Oh. I was just trying to, like say it how they would say it like they wouldn't say my name because it's well they can't they're not like voice acted to say that so that's why i said i hope she and then i was like wait a minute that's not how um english works like it would go um you're here the equipment uh has been calibrated miss trailblazer i have collected some questions myself not you are here the equipment has been calibrated she I collected some questions myself for the fan Q&A. It would go, as I said first, you are here, the equipment has been calibrated, Miss Trailblazer. I collected some uh, some questions for, uh, some questions myself for the fan Q&A. You understand how that goes? It's proper English, as I've come to an understanding. FQA segment, but let's start with the ones you got instead. We'll go back and forth like this between you and me, and answering questions so the vlog doesn't seem so stale. Come on, look at the, look into the camera. Given the students have already part, press the record button. Don't worry, just relax. Say whatever you like. I'll go back over and edit the good stuff before posting it up. I'm not. <laughs> Let's start with one of your questions. What did you get? Why did you become a vlogger? 
because the timing and circumstances were just right. I can perform in front of the camera and I get to meet, I get to interact with everyone in real time. So it's, it's, so it's exciting and I like it. Don't you think it's kind of awesome to make a living like this? I see one friend has asked, will you keep streaming in the future? Sure, I sure will. Why not? Anyways, I don't plan on leaving the Zheng Xinjiao anytime soon and I keep and I'll keep streaming in the future. I'm preparing and planning up future live stream segments which might be played at fixed times so it's easier for everyone to watch. Stay tuned. Thank you for the compliment, boss. In a nutshell, um, you just seize ch every chance you get to talk, talk and practice as much as you can. I used to have a weird accent when I talked. Everything, everything's thanks to my thick skin and chatting as much as possible with whomever I met. I used to love chatting on the star skiff and I'd lose track of time while chatting with the pilots. Lucky they never charged me an extra charge me extra. Teehee. See that smirk there? Actually, I'm taking that as the um thing. Yes, that smirk looks like my little sister's smirk when she's done something wrong. What's your favorite thing about Zhang Jiang's culture? The food, there's so much delicious food I personally love. Few recall, recu few res reserved old classics over Arum, Arum Alley. They bo they're both cheap and delicious. The Zhang Jiao cuisine is so broad and deep that if I don't eat it for a few meals, I'll go nuts. This stomach of mine, I feel like it's already an authentic Zheng Zhao stomach. Do your lords have any sweat? No way! Let me state again for who knows how many times now. Mir minors, please be under parent supervision. Please be careful if you're if you're in poor health. Everything is real and shot live without any editing in the post. I only dare to live stream thanks for to the protection of my mighty companions. They're all very skilled fighters, so we're asking you not to try this at home. Please seek assistance from Realm Keeping Commission if you head there yourself and encounter dangerous situations. And that's all. Phew! Great. Have you finished with all the questions over there? Come on, come on, I've got some questions with me here that I've collected up just for you. <clears throat> Here's one. I often see little Gu together with this tall, grey-haired, hot girl. Is she single? Bruh. And they are the worst on Widow. <laughs> I'm still a minor, you shouldn't be asking. <laughs> um, nah, I'm just, I'm just saying. Well, I hope you're satisfied with the answer to that question there, boss. It looks like Liz Marina is quite popular with our fans. Hey, Liz Marina, why are you blushing? Who's blushing? Not me. This kind of question is really, you know, it's just lighting effects. Huh, you really are blushing now. Huh, that's pretty cute. Fine, then let's fast forward on to the next question. Will your team keep streaming in the future? This one, let me answer this one for everybody. We'll definitely keep streaming in the future, but everyone has their own lives to live, so it's hard to line up everyone. Remember to follow our channel and enable notifications. This is a plug for me as well, basically. Can everyone do the same here? Like what, they, what, you, they, what people are doing in this world, do over here. Follow the channel. And enable notifications if you want to see our future, if you want to see future videos. We'll send out notifications for stream before we head out. Keep an eye out for it if you like live streams. And see if those little hands of yours can click, can click you a fortune. Don't forget to like and subscribe. All of you do the same thing that are watching right now. There are actually not that many um, people subscribed to our channel. I am getting a lot more views than subscribers. And let me look at the analytics real quick of everything. Only, um, only where is the analytic? Oh no. 
This is bad. Only... Only 0.7% of you are subscribed. So if the 99.4% of you can subscribe, that would be major help. So, yeah. Cool. All right, we're done after uh, we're done after finish record. Uh, all right, we are done after we finish recording this section. Viewers, or all, all like real react. I just made small edits. Hmm. You get Twitch again. We'll do. We'll do the usual. You do the posting. Whatever shall I do with you? Let me post it. I'm the best of posting. <laughs> nah. Compliment the streamer. It's a very good thing. Ghost hunting squad. A hundred thousand K special. Yes. Oh, I can't. If I if it ever happens, I know it's probably not going to happen for a very long time. But I hope to get a hundred thousand subscribers. Don't worry. Your reactions are very cute. There will be plenty of people who would buy it. Good work today. Once again, Miss Trailblazer. Goodbye. Damn. Surplus. I never heard the meeting point. Tell of all. Remember, 260,000. 260. There's no discuss. Oh, well. Have you ever thought of hosting another Q round of q and I didn't get picked. I need to be. Let's save the memorable. Let's save it for memorable occasion. Wait for the next melodon. Maybe next time get a melodon. Damn, this is just climbing, eh? Damn. Net total likes, total maturity, fans, whoa! Damn. Uh, let's do this one. Wait, 58.5k, 58.5k, okay, this one here. Let's do it, shall we? As I said, it's English. Uh, it's just the proper English, remember? I... I need to like make sure the English for a haunted house, a ghost. I can really, I can already smell our followers increasing. Oh nah, this must must be the work of a hilly of us. Yes, I imagine so. We're not ruling out the chance of fraud. She is is right. We need to visit personally to reach a pop a proper conclusion. So. Will you go? How? How? I found some clues that maybe that may be linked to tail on, on another post. I want to go and confirm myself. You go and do what you need. How? how. Little Gu, Liz Marina three hundred, and I will go to the haunted house. Don't worry, we're on. Actually, I want to find tail. <laughs> now we'll go with that one. Uh... Wait, did I choose the other one? No, I didn't. I looked down when I did that. Uh, Mitch, pressing the job for all, I'm not ghost hunting with that. That's right, thank you. I've messed with the person who made the post and sent out, sent me an address. All right, ghost hunting squad, let's move out, move out. Bro, imagine I get drafted. It will sound incredibly different when I start streaming again. <laughs> I don't want to get drafted. I have five hundred bucks, but you're finally here. It's me. I'm the the landlord of the haunted house. Call me Renlock. Woo! Let's go. It's time for our invest, invest to investigate your haunted house. Wait a minute. Where's the Ten Lords member? We may not be lord members of the Ten Lords, but we're still pretty capable. 
Is there something you cannot tell us? That's it's not that I'm looking I'm looking down on you. There may be many strange stories in the ghostly grove, and so many of them are baseless made up stories, but this time I've met the real thing. Without the assistance of the Ten Lords Commission, I fear that you alone may might not be of any use. Fine, there will be some things you, that I did not mention in my original post. You will understand once I explain. At first, the property. At first, this was just a property that I bought at a low price, thinking I've gotten myself a steal. But after they sold me the property, I never heard from the previous owner again. It was later that I learned that every pyre landlord had met an unfortunate end. Nah. Imagine buying a building, selling a building, and then dying after. Nah. I never used to believe in haunted houses or things like that, but ever since I moved in, I've developed a cough, and it was, and it's been difficult for me to even breathe sometimes. It's starting to make me nervous. After some time, I found a geomatic mark star, checked his compass, and said, though there are windows and palavan, there is no flow of yang energy. The courtyard walls do not foster with growth of wealth. There, 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 there is a sickness to the east and, a po and the population to the west lacking harmony in, com in community. The four directions are not favorable and the five elements clash. What's more, this house has a long history, and all the residents have met with ruin. Spirit fairs are frequent, yet cold, yet the spirits of the agreed uh, deadliner. My advice, move out within three days. If you fail, fall gravely ill, and tragedy will befall you. Okay. Yeah, that one. Once you're inside, you will know the master's telling the truth, even though I won't be able to... I don't. I didn't want this busted house anymore. It's still a personal asset. I'd like to sell it no matter the price if you're going to investigate the horse house. And you're... Well, well. While you're investigating the haunted house, how, could you help me find the deed? I won't be able to sell it without. Okay. If you do that, then I'll allow you to visit the haunted house. Easy enough. Leave it to us. I didn't. I don't really know where this baffling self-confidence of yours comes from. Well, it's just how it is. Tell us what's up. You can't. There we are. Well, shall we head over? Let's. I'm ready. Let's go. Uh, damn, that looks easy as hell. Ooh, ice. So I only have one of the three recommended. Oh, well. <laughs> this isn't a place exact. This isn't the... This isn't this place exactly the same as the Heliobus Labyrinth we've encountered before. So creepy. Ah, uh, there's limited resource in the Zhang Lao. I just had to pierce thing pierce things together with the blueprint of the small similar house. That must be the haunted house up ahead. So we're staying here tonight. Good night. Wait a minute, I'm not stupid enough to spend the night in this haunted house. Either way, we need to find the deed and investigate it. Find the deed and investigate the truth behind the Heliobus while we're at it. Two birds with one stone. Then let's... We'll put up the Haunted House investigation post and break, re, break in the followers. You make this all sound so easy. I'm a little concerned, come to think of it. I don't... Uh, don't you think that advertising board over there is a little out of place? Is this something that civilian can... Uh, is this something that should be in a civilian home? Nope. Come on, let's go take a look. Uh, nope. I'm joking. Investigate. 
And I have a child on board, looks out of place. No one has something like this in the house. We investigate closely. Just in closer and inspect the album time. Suddenly flips over. Comes to life. Whoa, Kafka! This is one to post for Kafka. Given that time's passed, the budget art incident, the life has already removed. The ones who notice this with the stellar on hunters. However, gra grassroots levels work can be slow. As you may see, still captures one to post it on the streets. However, a wanted poster after appearing in the courtyard of the apparent wanted house should raise some caution among you and your companions due to the unexpected nature. You should you shouldn't be here. You should probably get closer and take a look. Uh can I like not? Touch it. There we are. We would have expected this. Your first thought right now is Who are the animal? She's beautiful. Right, correct, but now is not time saying such things. Crash. A strangely coloured stone falls before your eyes as if someone has noted as if someone has noticed you looking at the wanted poster. There's no one around. Just where did this come from? As you pick up, you realize it's probably an important clue. At the moment, you hear ghostly voices coming from behind you, like an echo that directly imprints you into your brain. Save me, some kind of rustling sound says. It's so dark, I, I don't want to be trapped here. Please find me. This, this magnetic stone it is the false clue. Bring it to me. Come find me. Come and save me. This weakened voice comes to an abrupt halt. Did you hear that? It was a ventral spirit. Oh no, my phone's about to die. What do you mean, a ventral spirit? That's obviously a heliobus, right? Ah, uh, yes. Yes, it looks like all of the clues are hidden in this residence. All we need to do is find the heliobus and all the problems will be solved. This magnetic stone must have some use. Take it for now. Damn. Unusually colored. Wait, stone. Just a second, everyone. Damn. I'm breaking Cloud Knight's devastating wave. It's extremely sharp, so you just decided to take him in case it comes in handy. Mm. Shelf and move more reliable and stable. A plant, there's nothing out of the ordinary. A heavy stone, it looks like engraved some kind of scripts, kind of make out you could use rubbing paper, you may be able to copy the inscription and read it. I don't have the lock and kit one. I don't know. I'm going to do so this way. It's pretty little inside. It's the top side. It can be shut inside for me. Let's get a lock and check. Please, the side of it, you guys got to. I'm going to try to distract them. Oh, there's courtyard gatekeeping. Yay! I mean, that's not what I'm looking for. I'm not looking for the courtyard gate here. I'm looking for something else. I'm trying to put this. This must be the deed. Looks like there's a rice bowl. Square rice bowl. Makes sense. Hurry up, Packers. Takes me to be strong. Let's open it. It's here. Oh, yeah, key. Yay. What is this? 
Oh, bell looks like an item to call a small animal. Let's take it if it comes in handy later. Oh, bell. What that being? The key button C. Rest of them single, but with a sign. Now you sign. Close up. Okay. Average stone, growling sound, small hunger creature, now, now, wolf, wolf, I will. What? Eep, eep. Nice ball. What on earth is in that box? Seems like an invisible ball out of the box. Oh, points, relevance. Ah, 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 ah. Strange hand. Yep. And this here would require a rubbing van ball. Ah, yes. Yeah, so much To my unfamiliar friend, I trust that you come for my sake. However, before that, I believe you should become aware of what had transpired within the residence. As an outworder, burden. Out, as an outworder burdened with the gravely ill wife, I investigated a considerable sum to acquire this property near the Alchemy Commission. I have resided here for quite some time, and I have encountered numerous inexpectable phenomena which was seen to medicate from the corners and unexplainable chill occasion of fills the air with my own furniture and my own furniture would move on its own oh what okay the recurrence has led me to experience severe nervousness breakdown succumbing to overwhelming despair just as nearly i nearly listed my home for sale a real estate agent tormented for me, he inquired, Is this a haunted house? A haunted property like this won't fetch a high price. Selling it to me at a reduced rate would be your best option. However, I never disclose the haunted nature of my home to him. If you are perceptive enough, you, you might have discerned the true reason behind its haunting. I don't know that I don't know. I didn't don't do things like other people upon discovering the truth i resolve to seek re ret retribution i place the deed within the safe refraining from selling to anyone and let the agent wander about the place for all eternity i shall depart from the jinjiao for that uh, somehow for good ensuring that he never gains possession of this abode you may if you if you my unfamiliar unfamiliar friend wish to unlock the safe you must resolve the puzzle i have left behind m is one seven well uh, seven one eight three nine n is one seven one nine three v is one eight three the combination to the safe is written on the note affixed to the surface Enter the correct combination, and you shall discover the surprise I have prepared for you. Your mo your most sincerely, Ren Rock. Nice. So we just go to the safe over here. Okay. So everything we need. What is T? Top one. M is like M is like this. It goes what so eighteen probably. This would be that. What does this have to do? 
the game way towards that. The need is on sunset. Um, okay. Crystal's life and then attached him to reminding the owner of the password. Let's try and put in the password. As they said, password is T. There is no T on the lot. Then too much percent series of digits. He needs to find the clues to previous. Now enter the password. Enter the password. T. One. You try again. Wait a minute, three eight one. No, damn it. Three eight one. You want seven one eight right. Angel phase random package. Sometimes cast sip. Well, we ask Sally. Sally, look over to she's trying to keep her buried and find the answer yourself. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I get it. I'm going to try out. Let's give it a shot. Trying to see. I have no idea what it means, however, the shape can't wait. Oh, I see. One, two, three, eight. Ah! Stupid! I'm stupid! Damn it, I accidentally closed Twitch again. Sorry, everyone. Can't really see the stream. There we are. He successfully opened the safe alongside the D. There is something you never expected to see. A helio boss. You, you finally came. Blasted humans, cursed humans. How dare you do this to me? Oh, I should have put it in an angry tone then. Let's see what this does, shall we? Ah, uh, yes. Don't come any closer. I thought we should have waited for that. I'll crush them all. You could have surrendered. So what that? So I can't reasonably, I can't be reasonable. Finally, a living person for me to breathe at the sweet scent of life. Let me catch my breath first. What's wrong with all of you? Do you think these kind of terrifying tricks are funny? You almost scared me to death. Wait. Why shouldn't a hero device get scared? It's a dark. It's dark and creepy in here. It's terrifying. Ah, uh, we heard this from the land of the result. This place is haunted. We came to investigate. Our result, the landlord. Wait, you're talking about Renault? His name was Renzo? 
the owner of the house was indeed Renault and it was short last piece who decided who died a century ago so the person he actually saw was an imposter that's right the truth has been just that boy I never I, I, I've had enough here you lot get me to that gourd and let me out of here take me somewhere with life and yang energy if I call you your name, do you dare us wrong? My name is Bernie. Hurry and claim me. Damn, he wanted to get out of here real quick. So, what's the deal with Renault? This place. Look at this picture. Isn't this the same one on the deed? Oh, I saw that by accident. I didn't mean to see that. That indeed is the same person, the name on the deed is Renault. He is the outworder. So who is Renault? Um, I think I have an idea. Come, let's go back and see that landlord. That's not the landlord, is it? That's the agent. You're back. Well, did you find my deed? Wait, is that remote there? Should be dead. Indeed, that's the deed. How about... This is actually... Steed, it is... Is it not Renault? So, you are... Yeah, I already told you that, but I'm Renault. Wrong, Renault was a short life species that passed away a century ago. It says right here on the deed, you are not the real Renault. What? What? You faked the haunting. You're the one that chased the real landlord out of the haunted house. Sure, we're not in his family. Which one of these is you? We also found a message left behind by Renault. His family recorded multiple spiritual incidents. They encountered, in the end, these hauntings forced them to sell the place and move out of here. Just when you thought that no one would know who this outwater was you tried to sell the property but realizing this haunted house was really haunted you got scared you so you contacted the ghost of grove to hoping that the ten lords condition can drive away these ghosts for you oh we have all the evidence here i'm a cloud knight we'll be taking you uh, i'll be taking you with me to the realm keeping commission curse curse you now the trip and hind rest the wrong for the condition to handle. Yes. Let's go. I already explained the situation with wrong for the commission. I'm sure they'll be able to handle this. Let's go back to Fox Shore Garden and put the unfortunate Hilly of us in the suppression tower. Let's go. I never thought the results of the haunted house investigation would be that it wasn't haunted at all. Although it doesn't stop us from posting an update about this on the Ghost of the Grove. Nope, that one. I never thought someone would do something so deathless as thinking a haunting to scare someone off and then sell their assets for profit. Where we have a saying in my home, or sometimes a man's heart is even darker than demon. Seeing how scared that Heliobus was, I find I finally truly understood this phrase. Even though we found out the truth behind the haunted house, I still feel a little unsatisfied. Well, let's leave it there. We've got things to do. See you later. Yee. Oh. Oh, it's very good. 
Very, very good. I want to recommend my way of relaxing everyone. It's Garcia Haven. There's a place you can see to start the skiff lane and and just space out. You can do that in the sleepy spell too. Looking at the stars that's passing by, you won't even know how much time has passed. It's very soothing. Can't relate, can't relate. Can totally relate. Sounds like right. right, that's right. A little concern for both of your mental well being. Okay, okay, thank you for that. Um, hey, you have. If you have anything to share, ah, I can't, I can't look at any of this. It's not, that's not me. Ah, uh, no, don't die on me now, please don't die on me now. There we are. If you have anything to share, you know you're safe to talk to us, right? I've already been here for almost half a day, it's very relaxing. Oh, wait, huh? Did something happen? I'm back. Mr. Zhang Zayang came over and gave me a pocket full of candies without saying anything and left. What's going on? You know. Proves that your doorway. If I were nearby, I would have given you some candies too. Like, how can't can't help themselves but feed the curry fish in the pond? Don't those ponds discard feeling no one is discouraged from feeding how hard? That's true. Did we get sidetracked? I have some candies too. Where are you, how how? I have candies too. Full speed ahead. Yes. No need to come here. I've already left. Uh, no. Let me give you candy. You know, I rented a real murder house before there was really a woman sobbing. I couldn't find the source. Interesting. Let's go to the murder house. This one here. Radio. If I get a scary prank call when I'm while I'm live streaming, I'll definitely be good. It will be definitely good for the show. I think there's more like a bad debt or something or kind of vengeance how how what do you think i'm worried that the helio by are up to no good because the details in the post are true especially the part about deliberately ch choosing to call in the middle of the night as far as i know some helio by can be really crafty how and deliberately choose to ambush victims when they are completely off guard sounds pretty dangerous but can Heliobi use Jade Abacus or phones? Heliobi can't use Jade Abacus directly unless unless they take possession of a victim. Darn it. Better luck. Hmm. The best to get to best to get to the bottom of it. I think there are many more than one victim here. Let's split up. We'll meet the threads OP how how. You can go investigate the source of the scary call. Okay, I'll go to the Rose Realms Keeping Commission and ask around. Right here. It's getting late. Where to now? Just completely avoided that when that popped up. There we are. I knew it was you. You're that streamer. Are you you straight as? Yeah, it's AU. AU. Yeah, you can just call me AU though. Miss AU, can you please tell us what's going on? Late every night, my Jade Abacus will get anomalous, anonymous calls. I briefly answer them and this person tells me I have to meet them as they have something they want to tell me. When they call back later, the voice grows really weird, as though it weren't a human asking me why I haven't yet come, or suddenly bawling out of misery to the point that I almost carry... It, I'm almost carried off. Have you offended anyone? Of course not. I 
never really go out. How can I make any enemies? I plan to on going, but there's nobody at the harbour. I get this feeling which made my hair stand on end. I didn't venture out, but I can't control my cursed curiosity, and so I want to ask you to help me and go keep this appointment. I'll send you the coordinates. Please help that guy for me, please. A lot of pleases there. Da -da -da -da. Yep. Uh, okay. Hey there! Okay. Hey. Eliminate you. This is our chance. Possibly get you. You. Look at that. It's time. And done. New message. Have you arrived yet? Just arrived, still searching. Don't worry, we just got to the dock. Hang on, I just got pulled back and know the location is now at the place can used to be the passenger terminal, but it's empty since the scarf was slammed to change something feels off anyway. Gotta be careful. Yeah, you stay safe too, are you? Damn. Place change? What really happened? Yeah, you see that? Wait, is that how? Huh? Oh no, what's happened? Ah, watch out. Spirit never dies. Madden day. Do you admit this? You're trying to kill my friend. I should be the one that's mad. What did boost I get? I must be sorely mistaken, but that's a lot of damage. This is our chance. Click the uh... rules are made to be broken. That's all right. We just get rid of them. Oh. How are you doing? Oh, yeah, sure. We have split up. I just got back from the realm's keeping commission where the clerk helped me retrieve the coal logs from my jade abacus. The data shows the source of the coal was here. Very sorry, but Tail isn't here. I made some trouble with everyone. We're friends, so don't even sweat it so long as you're fine. That's all that matters. Excuse me, have we forgotten about something? It's wearing the great, great color jade abacus tracking display is right on top of it. But can the Marsha actually use jade abaca? The question we'll have to ask is the involved party. I'll stand guard and make sure it doesn't attack. Yay, we can actually converse with the dirt. Czar Wrath at Wrath Warning. Quick, help me out. Taking out so much various creatures means you all. Wait, outstanding cable, please. Won't you be good to very end and let me possess you for a few days? This seems familiar. Why are you a Heliobus? Huh? So you can tell, fine, no pretending anymore, just my luck. I find the host body and it turns out to be a stark carving lunatic. I can't 
take this. Can you please do me a solid and let me out so I can borrow another body for a couple of days? How can you instead of us? Am I building tubes? You know what? Budget. The no, I've just been temporarily borrowing for a couple of days, using your body to eat and drink, rest a bit. There's no big deal. Wait up, uh, please clear up for me a while. For me, what is the midnight ruckus was about before? You're not going anywhere until you do. Fine. Did I really tell you? Besides, there's absolutely no way I can escape right now. I was. Right now, I wasn't the one who did all of that violent stuff. She's incredibly insane and outside of my control. As for that Midnight Ruckers, that was when I'd finally managed to rest back control. When, well, she had a Jade Abacus on her with an emergency contact in it. So I kept trying to call them. I don't need to tell you what happened next. All right, I've finished explaining things to you. Now you're going to help me or not. I've got... I got a way to get you out, but I can't let you borrow me. You will have to go to prison and wait for, and wait a while. That's great. That's great. Everything's going to be great. So long as I can get out of this meat suit, I'm not stuck together with this maniac. Well, come out then. Right, well, it's, it's been more on companion watch for ages, but nothing happens. Is that the best you can do? I can't get out of this body no matter what I try. There's this, though, stuck in this girl's head. She doesn't let it go no matter what. It's blinding, binding us together tightly. Mara Strzok's lingering obsession. Could, could it be their emergency contract? Ah! Ahem, ahem. That wasn't me. Then, I hope it didn't scare you. I managed to read its last remaining thoughts stuck in the girl's head. Oh, by I know what she wants now. She wants to see the emergency contract in a Jade Abacus one last time. Say one final goodbye. Say goodbye to a friend. But not to mention whether or not she's friend meet up with Marsha. She doesn't want a friend to see her like this, right? Probably easy to take care of it if you want. To let me let me out of her body, I'll definitely grant her a wish. I get it. So I'm killing you now. Uh, do you want me to deal with you? Let's go. Yeah. I'm scared. Stay put. Give me strength. This is our chance. I'm gonna hold everyone back again. Stay the course. Um. Oh yeah, finally free trapping me inside herself like that was incredibly painful session. I will grant her final wish out of respect for such a formidable power. Come on, let's go see who was so infuriated with. Don't worry, I'll change into her appearance first. <laughs> oh, she's... Damn, okay. Good, now that's how I remember it. Don't worry, come on, let's get moving. Let's, shall we? Hey, you. No JPEG? No, I didn't. No, it's not in JPEG. It's actually, uh, it's actually built. It's not a JPEG. I'm about to go back right now. It's you after all of these years. I'm f you're finally thinking of coming back. It's me. I'm back. I thought you avoided me because you hated me. How could I if it weren't for you scolding me? Maybe I would 
be an insufferable wretch by now. I, sh I shouldn't have been so mean to you before. I shouldn't have signed you without asking me first. All I was thinking about then was sending you off. That's why I did something so stupid. Let, let the past be the past. Don't take it to heart. And I'm far too late showing my gratitude without you i'd be de i'd definitely still be ooh, discombobulated sorry about that call my jade abacus was broken everything was static good thing i'm seeing you now then it's getting late and you should go home no good hanging around outside this late but how long were we chatting for so what about you so you don't want to come you don't want to go home and take a look around? No, I've got something important with the Ten Lords Commission. Come on. I'll come and tell you. I come and tell you I'm safe that I should probably go back now. Well, always take extra care whenever you leave the house. Running errands. Well, now for the Ten Lords Commission, things are different now. I can help you out with anything. Alright. I n you notice AU seems anxious and fidgets with her neck. <clears throat> you notice AU seems anxious as her fingers fidget nervously at the helm of her blouse. How have you been? Perfectly good. Good. Perfectly good. Oh. Anything else you'd like to say to me? Um, nothing. Take care, AU. You too, little sister. Okay! Huh? huh? Little sister? Aiyang a -yang maintains solemn, sullen expression as the air around her seems to freeze. After all, she takes a deep breath and it finally breaks the awkward silence. I've been fine. You don't have to worry. Go with your mind at ease. As, as she is, and she lets out a deep sigh of relief and you notice the rims of her eyes becoming red really she gets lost of the night before letting out a sigh of her it's finally over now it's time for us to part ways goodbye all where do you think you're going didn't you promise you uh you'd do anything as long as we help you out there's a hilly bar help you out of there hilly bar really tricky get into the gar gourd now no, it wasn't a PNG. It was actually a physical 3D thing. Surprised myself, really. This one's slippery. Better get back to the Fox Troll Garden. I won't be able to relax until it's situated there. Where's the girl here? I want to talk to her. See if she's okay. Even though it was all just a mistake, something so, something still, something still somehow feels wrong, felt wrong. Those sisters ha are hard to understand, like Cloud Knights and their phrases. She already, she's already marstruck, but she still managed to hang in there, all because of her bigger sister. No wonder Heliobus possessed her. A pity to have lost touch with your own little sister for years. But when you meet again, it all plays out just like this. AU, do you think she already knows? Knows what? I mean... I mean, knows that her little sis her sister already passed away. Seeing her final expression, it felt like she knew. I think so too. She was crying at the end. The last line of hers was a clear indication. What a careful observation. There's absolutely no way I could have noticed that detail. Yes, seeing how she was, she probably needs to go back and digest things for a while. Feels like those have quite a few stories between them. People... But in people... Oh no. Just a second, everyone. Things dropped. 
my little things on top of my monitors have dropped. Oh no, get back up there. Has the thing dropped behind it? That has to. Sorry everyone. If things didn't drop, then we're going to be continuing. Get back up there. But if, but if things, but if the people involved are willing to stay, you can't just make rash inquiries into their personal affairs. Ah, forget about this. Ah, forget it. This midnight terror or whatever is now resolved. The two of them meeting up again is like some kind of reunion based on official processes. Somehow this should get sent out sent now that the assignment has been completed i thank you for your efforts miss trailblazer this one shall be the one great job that's all for today head home early Everyone's head home, uh, head home head home early. Everyone, see you all later. Well, it turns out our whole thing was a misunderstanding. I'm sorry about that, but I never thought I'd see my sister again after all these years. Anybody to ask if I'm in I don't see. Same here. Same here. My parents were both cardinals, but they both passed away when we were young. Since I didn't, ha I I had to support both of us. I had hard work all day. I didn't have much time to discipline my sister. As a result, she ended up coming a troublemaker and didn't even finish school. So I secretly applied for her to join the cardinals. I'm going to be more forces, straighten her out, maybe a better person. Damn, I can't. Maybe and maybe she'd become a better person when when I found out. What I did, we had a huge argument. She thought I was meddling in her life. I thought she'd refuse to serve and spill the beans to the military office, but she actually joined the Coward Knights after we started to drift apart. Eventually, one day, she disappeared without a, tri without a trace. I always thought she didn't see me because she resented me for enlisting her to the Coward Knights, but when I saw her today, when she transferred to look, she didn't have a chance to contact me and explain everything now that she's doing work and finally breathe a sigh of relief when you get about misunderstanding. Sorry, you drag family drag. I'll be supporting you. Oh no, she thinks she's still alive. Oh no, this is bad. This is very bad. This is very, very bad. Because of one thing, she's going to look forward to seeing her little sister again, and it won't happen, because she's dead. Oh no. Oh well. Looks like so far this is just all about ghost hunting, eh? Amount of 64,000 in what? A million. Four. Phase four. Fox Troll gathering. Four. New message sent. Everyone, something terrible has happened. How is missing? Where? Did, um. What did she say? Where she was going? Before she left. No, she didn't. I think it was about something been off since so yesterday. Ah. Uh, it happened. Calling out to her in the group chat won't help. We always contact uh Kaya right away. Let's meet in the usual place. There's only well can't afford to lose any members. I've already published a published a post since you're here. Do it a try. Uh, just stop at pinging people and come to the social <laughs> cut. <laughs> uh, seriously. Oh, I got another message as well. That's gone pretty wild. How did you find out? How did you just find out? 
She's right here. She, she, she just messages. Do you need to go online more? What are they saying though? They announced the Lugia announcing it during the last stream. Go into the top of the activity and guess what? 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 I mean, what? You're the one that saw us. I was shocked that you didn't know. That earnest made me black black out. You were saying that the word on the street that goes around is why I totally so is this true? Totally true. This is fake news, misinformation. My goodness, neither of you watch my stream. Did you watch my stream? Uh oh, you didn't say that. That's what you said. Fifty fifty. Did you watch? Damn it! Yeah, this might make good content. In to fake fake you next stream next month. Let's begin this mission. She is missing, and we shall go find our comrade. Wait a minute. I'll read that again. We must go to our comrade. How much? Should be one. Wait a minute. Damn. Yeah, no. Yeah. Yes. That's why I claimed it. Because I want that background. By just. Yes, 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 yes. I mean, this background is good, but I like this one. Whole episode. I'm looking at the reply. See? <clears throat> Here. Miss Hanya said she's on her way. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> Have you not been asking when you used? I'm going to stream every day. Damn, I used to love you out of stream, especially alive, shopping, and wondering, what do you like this? There's so many, let me think. Is there anything else? I don't think there's anything else. But this here. Yeah, this is the only one. It appears we are all present. The spirit bearers who were supposed to report to Huo Huo mentioned they didn't see her today. <laughs> I'll get straight to the point. I have no idea where Huo Huo may be. However, if we combine our efforts, we may be able to piece together some clues. Each of you are close to Huo Huo. Did you notice anything unusual about her yesterday? Since becoming a judge, Huo Huo has often thought about resigning. She thinks she might not be cut out for the task. If you ask me, after she lost tail, I think her urge to resign became even more apparent. What if Huo Huo came across a lead today? Something that sounded like Tail's doing? Knowing her, she's probably gone looking for him. Yeah, that is true. And yet, she didn't come to any of us for help. That's not oh. like her. Given the type of person she is, 
If yeah. she did have any clues, she would seek out our help. If she hasn't shared anything with us, it means there is only one possibility. Guess what, everyone? I know there's like little people watching, but Zero, you remember when I clicked the Windows button and it showed a uh, different name? I can now click it freely. Hmm. Yes. It finally says my name. Finally. These headphones have been 50% for the last four and a half hours. What is going on? See? My name is there. Yeah. Solid air. <laughs> Just do a solid air thing. Nah. She's been deceived. Perhaps she didn't trust us. Correct. And I think I might yes. know who the culprit is. Cirrus. The only one who may have knowledge of Tails' whereabouts is Cirrus. Whose plans of were course. foiled due to Tails' actions. Even if Cirrus doesn't know where Tail is, given the shared history, they wouldn't hesitate to cause trouble. Yep. Let's go. We must try to squeeze some answers out of Cirrus. Cirrus. Foxy in dream. Speak, not hate. Can't function. Who don't know when to quit. Why, since you have questions, go on, ask away. Quahua is missing, and I'm willing to bet you know something about how careless <laughs> your companion vanishes right under your noses, and you fail to notice. Why am I the one you're pestering? The Ten Lords Commission might not be able to completely eradicate the Heliobi, but we have plenty of ways of dealing with them. Ooh, how threatening. <laughs> Save your breath. I know your tactics. Let's cut to the chase. I do know something about it. Let me beat your ass and then we can continue. I it. Believe it or not, while you were distracted, she came and found me. She asked me if I knew where Mr. Tail was, and I simply gave her a clue. She searched high and low, but came back empty-handed, of course. If only you could have seen her expression. Simultaneously terrified and desperate to know more. <laughs> Utterly hilarious. Sure. In the end, I became fed up with her constant nagging. I told her that her beloved Tail had splintered and been reduced to an ember without a single memory. You should have seen her face! <laughs> Bro! Okay. First off, props to the kids that can handle this power of the people. But still. I started feeling sorry for her. Out of pity, I told her that her tail was hiding in Cloudford. Preparing to flee the Sienjo on a star skiff. I also told her that the Ten Lords Commission was in the process of recapturing all the Heliobi. If she were to turn to you for help, Mr. Tail would be imprisoned. Even if she managed to find him. Looks like she took the bait. Lies! You can't possibly know where Tail disappeared to. Maybe I do, maybe I don't. But I have no doubt about one thing. My friends are ready and waiting for her in Cloudford. You should have faith in your friend. Perhaps Wawa is safe and sound. Perhaps she managed to subdue the Heliobi. If you rush to Cloudford, there's still a chance you might find her. Not good. Yeah. Let's head to Cloudford quickly. The paperwork will have to wait. I'm coming with you. Okay, good. Let's go, shall we?
Oh no. Ironic. Hold on. Let me take a look at her. I Henya carefully examines how house visual signs. She's unresponsive. It looks like a heliobus has taken control of her mind. What's happening? Huo Hua spent a long time in coexistence with a heliobus. It is likely she became accustomed to that state. With tail now gone. She was relatively defenseless against other Heliobi. This isn't something the healers at the Alchemy Commission can handle. I'll take Huo Huo back to the Ten Lords Commission. Perhaps they'll have an answer. No, we can help. As for now, I'm temporarily suspending the activities of the Ghost Hunting Squad. No! But... The situation has changed completely. Without the assistance of a judge, continuing would place all of you in grave danger. Defeating the purpose of the squad. But Miss Hanya, this is to save our friend. I know. I understand. But please, let the Ten Lords Commission deal with this. Miss Hanya, tell me straight. Does the Ten Lords Commission actually have a solution? <sighs> yeah. Cirrus is bound to know what this Heliobus is up to. No. We shouldn't do what they expect us to do. They've been manipulating us from Fixtral Garden all along. We need to find out what they really want before we go any further. We are not completely out of op. It might be possible to use another Heliobus to drive out the one that seized Wohua's mind. But why would a Heliobus ever want to help people? Wait. Miss Hanya, do you mean to say that... And it produces the lover of God. I've been keeping tail here all along. You have got to be kidding me! Seriously, have you? Oh, you. Can I give you a weapon real quick? I want to beat your ass up. What? Don't look so surprised, young lady. Surprised? Uh, Hua Hua has been worried sick trying to find you, and now something else has got after her. You flaming furball! What the heck is going on? Did you know about this the whole time, Miss Hanya? As per our rules, any free roaming Heliobus must be sealed away. I was merely following protocol. Besides, it was Tail who requested this. <sighs> It's a long story. Tell me it straight, boy. I only recall a moment during that fateful night when my consciousness was on the verge of shattering into a million pieces. Time stood still. I watched myself parting from Ignamar, drifting without purpose. Then, before I knew what had happened, the girl had retrieved me, and a judge of the Ten Lords Commission had sealed me within a tail. I believe you humans call this kind of thing an end-of-life experience. But why would a Heliobus experience one of those? Ridiculous. Since I'd slipped the leash, I thought I might as well change bodies and savor a bit of freedom. But then... Uh, Lucky for you, you met me. My luck took a sour turn when I ran into this demoness. I mean, judge. When I was with Hua Hua, she'd constantly rant about me. Whining about all the problems I'd caused her. How I'd ruined her life. <laughs> uh, it was only after I vanished that she realized she'd taken my power for granted. I wanted to hear her cry about it. So, in a fit of anger, I had this demon, a judge, imprison me in the gourd. You had had your wish. Now, I'm offering you a chance to regain your freedom. Not by letting you go, but by going back to the way things were. Do we have a deal? <sighs> Can I trust you, Tail? Ugh. Of course! We're pretty much co-workers at this point. <sighs> so, all I have to do is possess Hua Hua and take out those other pesky Heliobi, right?
Ooh, will I be able to do that? Hallucination detail. Time to give this heedless creature a reality check. Just a moment, but still do that. I need to look at something. Just a moment, everyone. Be right back. Alright, I'm back. <laughs> it's exorcism o'clock! Yay. Perfecto. Privileged are worthy of being his hosts. Mom? Is this an illusion? Mom, what are you doing here? I've missed you so much! S -s Stay back! Don't come any closer! I don't know who you are, but you're not my ho ho. Keep that filthy thing you're carrying away from me. Okay. The farther you stay away from her, the better. I'm sorry, Hua Hua. Your father and I had no choice but to send you to the Ten Lords Commission. Oh, it's best if you pretend we never existed. Wrong. <laughs> now, even for a Heliobus, that is cruel. Cool. For you, I can't stand people who do that. <laughs> Plain dumb, don't want to talk. We shouldn't be talking to a monster anyway. Let's get out of here. But I'm not a monster. Damn, you look sad as hell. Bad if I was to probably use that. No, I did not screenshot. Use my muffin. What should I do? Tail. Not tail. Tail? How are you? How are you still here? I see now. You're leaving me too. 
Everyone always leaves me. I don't want to be alone. Not again. I haven't left! Please, Tail. No more words. I can't bear to see you fade away. Are you a judge or not? This Heliobus is distorting your perceptions. Get a grip! Resist them! They've all gone. All abandoned me. All gone? Just watch me. I'll drag them all back. <laughs> Oh, that is cool. No, you can't say that is not cool. Nah, 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 you can't say that is not cool. That is cool, that is cool as heck. Possession. Let's bring this one back. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. It's better that you pretend mom and dad are no longer here. How can your own flesh and blood be so heartless? These humans. The dress makes life chance so nice. Add another one to my left. Oh, wait, what? Okay. I'm not last night after this. Let's bring this one back. Taking control of a child. Whoa. Very drifty. I don't know. Very drifty, very fun. Get so much attention. I'm gonna get everyone to ignore her. Ugh, the behavior of these brats is astounding. Can I control two of them? Oh no, just for the one child. Okay. This tail is just so creepy. It glows like some sort of torch. Rose! Hey! Wanna lose a hand? See? <laughs> That's kind of funny. Oh, oh, look! I brought everyone back for you. <laughs> Who's back? <sighs> Whoa, our precious girl. Mom and Dad shouldn't have left you all alone. Whoa, whoa, I'm sorry. I was just jealous that your tail is cooler than mine. Whoa, whoa, I've always dreamed about having such a cool tail. Why don't you come play with me? <sighs> well, they're only here because you possessed them and made them come back. This isn't what I meant. Oh, come on. You wanted them to return. They return! Tail? You're not an illusion. Oh, oh, you're here! You're actually Tail! Oh, oh. Where have you been all this time? I thought you were already... Dead? Well, I haven't exactly had a picnic. Exploding into countless shards, being your shadow for all those rotten years. It's about time I had some good luck. I thought about getting out of here, but uh, I couldn't shake the feeling there was something wrong. So I came back to see if you could manage on your own, or if you were still a scary cat. 
I'm sorry. I guess I still am. No! You're selling yourself short. You're daring. How you had the courage to do something so dangerous amazes me. It's not bravery you lack, but yeah. sense. <laughs> Common sense. Uh, what <laughs> other choice did I have? I suspected that Cirrus was deceiving me, but the thought of losing you forever was... Uh, unbearable. Forget about all that. I'm here now. But... Did everyone really leave you because of me? You know what? They left. Let them be. I'm not a people person anyway. Without you, Tail, they'd have left me just the same. Well, since you put it like that, I suppose I have nothing to feel guilty about anymore. <laughs> then he just kills them. <laughs> That'll be funny. Uh, well, somebody needs to keep you out of trouble. Speaking of which, there's a pesky Heliobus lurking right here. I'm coming for you. Don't even think about escaping. Wait, do I get to fight as him? Oh, Bell. Brave the wind. Unscathed. It's time. What's that? That means it will damage when the balance side is ice damage because it's in thousand of the unit's defense to the attacker. <laughs> Cannot. This damage cannot crit, hit, you defeat, and cannot defeat the enemy every time this attack stops. <laughs> okay, um, if it's according to my thing, uh, it would be, it was, so if you, let's see. That is 27,660 damage. It was just that one. Now if it was that one. Gosh darn. Are you wanting to do like infinite damage or something? Can you see that? Not dead yet. Surprised, not dead. Do you admit this crime? Yes. The wind is right. From the blow. No amnesty. Yes, this one's good, but I need to have a high defense. This is our chance. Component damage. Threat raise. Threat raise. It's time. Component damage. Threat raise. Attack a person. Go on. You see that much damage? Bruh. Yes. Challenge complete. Thanks it. Congratulations. Let's go. Oh, you're awake. Seems like Tails' operation was a success. Was indeed. Madam Hanya, Miss Quay, Su Shang, and Miss Trailblazer. Thank you, all of you. Are you the ones who brought Tail back? Hmm. Well, where would we be without our squad leader? We had to help. Oh, so Scaredy Cat is squad leader. Well, well, look at you. Uh, that's just what Miss Gwainiphen calls me. <laughs> well, well, Tail actually does belong to Miss Wahua. 
Excuse me? Despite Cirrus' scheming and calculating, they clearly didn't expect Tail to return to Huo Huo. Their plan to kidnap her was an utter failure. If they saw Huo Huo as she is now, it would break their will. Madam Hondiff, urgent news from Fictional Garden. The subdued Helium by are stirring again. Cirrus may not know the location of Tail, but they still figured out a way to divert everyone's attention. This is definitely curious, he's refused to divert, I haven't seen him. Uh, it's not because of me, is it? There's no need to blame yourself. This was Cirrus's plan all along. Yes, it indeed it was. It's like the end game that General Jing Yuan no. has been trying to avoid is fast approaching. Sushang, please head to the seat of Divine Foresight and fetch the General. Let's hurry back to Fixtral really? Garden now. While there's still a chance to turn things around, it's time to teach Cirrus a lesson. We will be able to finish the entirety of this thing in this one episode. Yes! Oh, wait, we didn't. We haven't got to a million followers yet, though. Shh. Okay. If it isn't the judges at the Ten Lords Commission, sluggish as ever. Oh, and is that Mr. Tail? Back to being a guard dog, I see. How delightful. This calls for a celebration. Still, after our last encounter, I have no intention of including you in my plans. To see Ignamar's most powerful fragment now burdened with emotions pains me. It's a pity, but you've become expendable. Who are you calling expendable? The Ten Lords Commission's Matrix is still intact. The Heliobi cannot leave Fixtral Garden. You may think you have the upper hand, but you're nothing more than a caged animal. You will never leave here. Leave? That was never my plan. I came to Fixtral Garden for one reason and one reason alone. To fight the Lofu's formidable general? No, I'm gonna beat your Just ass beforehand. I'm playing the waiting game. I merely capitalized on that. Well, you were all out on a wild goose chase. I rallied other Heliobite in my cause. Thereby increasing my strength. Thanks to all of you, I've amassed the power of every Heliobus sealed within Fixtral Garden. All I need to do now is wait for the General to make his grand entrance. Before that happens, I should keep my end of the bargain. Destroying you without leaving a trace. I'll beat your ass beforehand. And if not, we're gonna see an epic battle anyway. Prison. How delightful. Try this again, please. I did it wrong. I was gonna die and then pay it up, chill. Oh, yeah, because we've already done it. We can skip the story. Sorry about that. Yep. Yeah. Number four to get one damage. Ah. Uh, Crush them all! Break the wind! 
Imprisonment. Attack you. all of you. Attack all of you. to physical attacks. Cirrus is merely putting on a brave face. The moment they sense even a hint of defeat, it's over. They'll break into pieces regardless of how powerful they are. So, just like what happened to Ignamar, once a Heliobus realizes they're going to lose, they'll shatter? Exactly. And if there's anyone who can cause Cirrus to shatter, it's him. So, General, you finally decided to show up. Ready to face the music? Defeat my army and I'll give you the rematch you seek. <laughs> my words hold true. As I mentioned previously, when Tang Xiao and Ignamar fought, the scales were balanced. But for you, Cirrus, this game was never about fairness, was it? And yet here we are. My power decidedly outmatches yours. Notions of rules and equal competition are mere illusions. Now, if you don't mind, allow me to show you how the end game is played. Mm. Only him? No. Break the wind. It's time. Let's make it quick. Trying to check on the technicalities. It is true. Without them, I'm sorry. You already know this. First story. Break the wind. Let's go. Rules are made to be broken. Let's make it quick. It's 
accept your defeat. You are bested. Oh. the head. Lucky then. Oh no. Stop. Big a stall. Let's go. Eliminated. Accidentally clicked it, and I was like, I might as well get the screenshot. I know of no faint flicker. Because I was, I was holding the Windows button when I clicked it, but it must have not, it must have not registered. If it was to register, I could have just did a quick one like that, like that, but it didn't register. So I, I, it made it do this, where it still frames everything. Damn. Well, listening to a winner feign humility is enough to make one sick. The heliobi may reflect our desires, but their fervent blaze is undeniably awe-inspiring. Neither General Tung Xiao nor myself would deride such a foe. I have been bested. It's true. I only sought to lock horns with you, regardless of victory or defeat. Next, I'll... Next is eternal punishment. For an inextinguishable flame such as yourself, I see no punishment more fitting than to see you confined to a vacant abyss, forever lamenting your past transgressions. Such is the fate that awaits you, Cirrus. <laughs> so be it. Mountains will crumble. Oceans will evaporate, but the Heliobi will always be there, patiently waiting for their day of freedom. That day will come. As long as the generals of the Sienjo live, my battle against them will continue. Until the stars themselves burn out. Nice. I'm sure I'll talk to them. I'm talking. Cirrus's will to fight has been shattered. It can no longer pose a threat. Considering that everything here is now under control, I'll take my leave. Okay. Yes. I nearly fulfilled my duty and kept my promise to Cirrus, but the Heliobus we dealt with will not be easily dismissed. Given sufficient time, and regardless of how slim the odds are, they will someday break the seal that binds them. However, that concern will fall to the generals of the future. One cannot help but wonder how many lawful generals this fragment of Ignamar will face in times to come. Speaking purely from the perspective of a warrior, I must say, I feel somewhat envious. <laughs> hey, my objective is pretty simple to understand. That it may be, but they cause no shortage of trouble. Perhaps I could glean some wisdom from the Sienjo Juming. 
This excursion was not an official matter. I didn't report it to the councillors. What remains of it will be left to the Ten Lords Commission. And once matters have concluded, I believe everyone present Ooh. will be duly rewarded. How about that child? That child the, the, the children's probably getting underpaid. They need to get paid now. And as for you and the young Miss Gwynaifin, rest assured you won't be shortchanged. You see? Helping the general of the Law Fu does have its perks. <laughs> Oh, whoops. I accidentally hit my head on the ground. I'm, uh... Damn. Just noticed I'm getting a little bit tired. So I'm just nearing the end of it anyway. Speed, not haste. We go fast, we can go fast, 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 fast. Wait a minute. Done that, done that. We still can't do that one over there yet. In order to catch Perfect. You're here. I've just finished reinscribing the seal on Huokwa's tail. Next, it's time to address the matter of Cirrus. Uh, you see them sitting. If I were merely starfire essence, then naturally I'd prefer to glide through the cosmos. <sighs> but after being entangled in your human world, my freedom is no longer that simple. Yep. I'm freer than ever before. I'm going nowhere. Mm. Nice. According to the Ten Lords, Tail must be supervised by a judge. <laughs> I'll make sure to take good care of Mr. Tail. <laughs> yep. Let's see who takes care of who. Let's see. Mm, besides, when Mr. Tail isn't around, the other Heliobi pick on me. I feel safer when Tail is here. <laughs> other Heliobi? <laughs> I'm the only Heliobus you need to worry about. I swear, he's gotten bigger. Well then. I will take care of the Sira situation. As for what gets written in the Lawfu's ghostly grove, I'll leave that up to you. One more thing. Don't forget to seal the Heliobi within the evil binding matrix. Yes, ma'am. Oh my gosh, let me make it all the way back there. Uh, is there a quick pause? Well, let's Please try these spots. Not haste. Wow. Can't That's it. For them. Here we are, just on time too. Monster slaying and demon fighting stuff I've been doing for the Ten Lords Commission. What did you tell her? I told her I went toe to toe with the sword fighting prodigy Yen Ching and held my own against fragments of Ingramar. But all she did was scold me for getting into trouble. Do you think she was being sarcastic? Yeah, I think she was. What could be more important than protecting the Xian Zhou from the threat of Heliobox? <laughs> Quit worrying, Su Shang. You've been an awesome squad member and a very, very talented, talented sleepyhead. sleepyhead. Now, let's think about what to publish on Ghostly Grove. This is huge news. This post will definitely boost our following. I think it was by 400,000. Always on the hunt for more followers. It's called professionalism, all right? I'm counting on you. Just has see skin dog bread freak. Nah, that one. The 
ghost hunting squad can now rest easy for a while. Speaking as a judge of the Ten Lords Commission, I must thank you all for the dedication you've shown these past few days. You really minimized the impact of the Heliobi crisis. Literally went down from my thing. There may have been a few Heliobi that slipped through the net, but they are of no major concern. Leave them to us. I don't want to brag, but our articles on Ghostly Grove are the talk of the town. If we suddenly stopped uploading, it'd be pretty unfair to our audience. Miss Gwei. Madam Hanya, uh, please let little Gwei carry on uploading. I can't fall asleep without browsing Ghostly Grove before bed. <sighs> you seem pretty set on this, so I won't stand in your way. However, bear in mind that... Don't worry. We promise not to make your job any harder than it already is. Yep. The General's Lightning Lord is so cool, so cool. So cool, my first time seeing it. So cool every time. Right, right? Let's go back to the topic. Congrats to How How for getting Tail back. Yeah, I would have thought Tail was with Hanya. I heard it took Tail a long time to recover. Must have been tough. Hold on, something just crossed my mind. Are you planning to take a photo of Tail? Wait, how did you know? Well, don't push yourself. This will be good. Thank you. I just uh, isn't interested. Let's find plenty of other topics to discuss. First things first, let's check our account. Let's, shall we? Foxy and Dream complete. Visit verification. How has became a pert visitor on the express. New messaging has arrived. Greetings, do you remember me? It's me, the Heliobus who disguised as Spring Young's wife. The he oh my gosh. Okay. That, 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 that's a lot. That's a lot. Uh, I kind of had a message going on. I'm messaging someone. You know, there's enough permission to go away. You know, it came back with quite a truce and then it was close to the deceased present heights. I'm trying once and done, I'll be waiting for you soon, man. See you there. Okay. Uh, we do this. Click those stories if I as well. There's gonna be one for hitting a million. I'll tell you that for sure. We can go to this one real quick. Is there anybody who can go get money? Oh shoot, over there, okay. Before that though, we shall do all of this. Loss and reflects damage for all allies. Whoa! Recommended, but I like the one that I've been doing. That one that absolutely destroys everything. You, 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 yes. You can't hurt me. Spirit never dies. Fiends or devils, I'll crush them all. You could have surrendered. <laughs> Order of the Ten Lords. Execute the Mara Struck. Uh, yep. Boom. Give me strength. As easy as that. It's time. <laughs> huh. 
The wind is rising. Bolt! From the bow! Complete. Next one. Spirit never dies. You could have surrendered. Did I say 90,000 or was that 900,000? Let me check back. Let me check back real quick. 90,000. Okay. Ooh, we got whoever that is again. And it was annoying. Nice. Yeah, we're a bit over five hours. That's okay. It's okay. Yeah, 
Brave the wind. Do you admit this crime? With me. Let's go. I'm gonna hold everyone back again. Protect me, protect me. Don't come any better. These are devils. I'll crush them all. Just a scratch. As easy as that. For the cloud. No, that was the wrong action. Oh well. Okay. Finally, I got every single stage completed. Just these remaining. I can go back. Oh, it's right there. Uh, actually. We can leave that for tomorrow me to uh today me in the morning to be for um uh, looks like we're gonna we're gonna do all of this tomorrow because of well I am tired. I can tell you that for sure. I am tired and I need some sleep. So Oh my gosh. Oh, well. And I want to go to bed. Sorry about that. But good night. Um, for the people watching this, um, on Twitch live, thank you so much for watching to the end. I hope all, uh, I hope to see you all tomorrow slash today. At 10 p.m. EMT plus 8. Um, and I had a great time streaming. Thank you so much for the. And if you're watching this back on Twitch, you can watch this live as well. If you don't want to watch it uh, on YouTube, you can watch it live here on Twitch. Um, but. Again, for the people watching this back on YouTube, on the right here is my latest video, on the left here is my first video of the series. But be warned, from 15 to 30, it is a little bit laggy, so it's okay to skip them, because I will skip them myself, because they're irritating. Um, if you like more videos like this one, please click that like button, and please, can you please, uh, can you consider subscribing? And if you want to get notified for future uh, future uploads, can you please click that notif- uh, can you- you can click that notification bell. I'll see you all next time. Sorry for all the stutters.